doubt that anyone could keep paintwork that's that old in such good condition. These are a classic old car, um, six cylinder automatic. They, um, they had ran, ran what they called the MB Tex trim, which was like a, a leather vinyl sort of thing that Benz has ran, but a very good classic car, wood grain dash. Still got the factory hubcaps on it. And uh, just an old, look at that, it's the old car phone, car aerial. You don't see those anymore, do you? I don't think the phone's still in it, but everything else is there. But a good classic car, and these things are something that are, are a really nice old Tura. Very nice car to drive, and it's all there. Very original headlight protectors and everything on it. German motoring at its best. Back to you, Lee. Thank you, Ryan. It's a one-owner vehicle with books. We've got an online bid of $7,000. Kevy, what's it worth? All right, again, we'll find out here today. At $7,000 now, I'll take 300 to go. At 7000 here. At 7 the bid now, buyers, now we're going to bid 7000 Having bid online there, buyers, now we're going to bid 7000 to go. At 7000 now. Look at the three to play there, buyers, now we're going to bid 7000 Have a look at it there. At 7000 here. At 7 the bid is on the net. Online buyer now, buyers, now we're going to bid $7,000. Who's got three to play? Come on. At 7 the bid. At 7 the bid now, buyers, now we're going to bid $7,000. Come on, don't waste your time on this one. Three, we got it online. 73 online. At 7300 bucks. At 73 the bid is online there, buyers, now we're going to bid 73 Look at the Six next at seven three now seventy three hundred bucks and in front on the net at seven three now at seven three the bidder buys now we're gonna bid seven three looking for another three to play who wants it here today at seven three now at seventy three hundred bucks and go at seventy three the bid at seventy three the bidder buys now we're gonna bid seven three online at seven three now seventy three hundred bucks the bid now buys now we're gonna bid seven three the bid is on the net at seven three now and in front at seven three now at seven three the bid now uncontested here we go seven three we're done finished now seven thousand three hundred we'll time him out thank you. Down, close them off the line. We're rather than through. Thank you, boys. There, and we're back over to Toby. What have we got next, Mike? Thanks, Kevy. Lot 29. We've got the 57 Austin Champ. To kill these things, you'd have to throw it into a volcano. They do not die. They've got the four four cylinder Rolls Royce engine, um, designed for the British Army, um, as you as you might might see there. Um, as I said, Rolls Royce engine, very very tough engine. Five forward gears and five reverse gears, so it's very unique. The Champ coming up, 1957. The yeah, British Army, uh, they were originally designed for the British Army, weren't they, Bill? Yeah, they were. Mate, they run a um, Rolls-Royce engine in them right. um, with the snorkel on there, designed um, to actually go underwater. Wow. So they're a uh, fully steeled engine, um, separate forward and reverse gears in them. Um, just, mate, they were ahead of their time. They were deserve, uh, designed for the uh, British Army, as mm. we said. So, um, mate, we've sold quite a few of them, and uh, they're very highly sought after. This looks like a very tidy unit though, doesn't it, Bill? But it does. Um, I haven't had a close look at it Nor myself, no. but um, certainly going by the photos there, mm. it's, it appears to be a great example. Yeah. And, uh, mate, I think it'll be interesting to see what it makes. They've sort of been making around that between seven and sort of twelve, thirteen thousand dollars $13,000 mark for the yep. real good one. So yep. uh, why don't we go back to the blocks and see how this one goes. At 32, the bit now, 32, the bit we all over and done. 32 now, at 32, the bit now, 32, the bit we finish. Last call, 3200 bucks. Time him out of line, 32, thank you. And that's referred to the phone bidder, thank you there, 3,200. Back over to Lee now. We'll draw that raffle prize. All right, Kevy, thank you. Uh, we've got an online viewer who's uh, come forward for the, been another winner for the raffle prize. Ashley Baker, thank you for your support. That's uh, someone in Queensland finally has uh, come forward. So, Ashley, you've got two cars to come forward and give us your draw number and we'll draw your prize on your behalf. And Kevy will draw the in-house. So everybody have your ha raffle tickets ready. Hey, go on. Here we go. All right, that's green ticket, F56, UG. Yuji, if you could come forward and uh, see the team, we'll be calling the prizes shortly. So Yuji, we'll go back to the auction, come forward, and uh, hopefully it's the, it's the big one. Go to watch and Ryan. Okay, mate. Next one coming through is a 1972 VW Beetle. Uh, it's finished in a, like a pale green, you'd call it. There is bumpers to go with this car. The car's only just been repainted. Still the last of the flat screens. The 75s, I think they went to the 74s, went to the curved screen. It, uh, it presents well. It's a good little car. It's, uh, as I said, fresh paint. It's supposed to be good mechanically. I haven't driven the car, but it's all there. The bumpers will come with it. And... Uh, I just love Beetles. I reckon they're a classic car, and you just the, you compare the new ones to the old ones. The old ones just had so much more character, and I think this one's got plenty, and plenty of life left in it. I'll pass it back to you, Lee. Well said, Ryan. We've got an online bid of two thousand two hundred and fifty dollars. 
What's it worth? Right, right. She'll be all over it. Two and a quarter. Kick this one away. I'm looking for two hundred now. At two and a quarter, bid down buyers. Now we're going to bid two and a quarter online. At two and a quarter, opening bid down buyers. Now we're going to bid two and a quarter. At two, two fifty. Yes. Two, four fifty on the phone. Twenty four fifty buyers. At twenty four fifty in front on the phone. There buyers. Now we're going to bid two four fifty on the phone. At two four fifty now. Phone better there. At two four fifty now. At two four fifty now. Look at the six fifty. Who wants it next? At two four fifty now. Two four fifty and in front. At twenty four fifty there buyers. Now we're going to bid two four fifty here. At two four fifty. Was that a bit there? Dudley yes. twenty six. Twenty six. 50 here and in front at 2650 now you're out on the phone at 2650 here at 2650 the bid now we're gonna bid 2650 here at 2650 the bid at 2850 yes. on the phone at 2850 I need another 200 dollars if you want to there we're gonna bid 2850 here at 2850 on the phone and the 850 3050 yes. 3050 3, and in front at the 3050 here at 3050 the bid now buyers now we're gonna bid 3050 and in front and in front in the front row there buyers now we're gonna bid 3050 you want to be a quarter on the phone we're yes. gonna quarter on the phone at three and a quarter now at three and a quarter now yes. 450 450 now at 3450 3450 do you want another two on the phone at 3450 here and in front in rooms at 3450 now you're out on the phone 3450 who else wants to join in for another 200 in the MNO? at 3450 here on the middle there buyers now we're gonna bid 3450 here 34 in the front row 3450 here at 3450 450 the bid buyers now. Come on, we got a bit 3450 now. At 34, yes. 650 on the phone. At 650 now. 3650. At 3650 the bid. Come on, another 200. You ever know there, Dudley? Now we got a bit 3650 on the phone. On the phone buyer now. We got a bit 3650 now. And out we go. At 3650. Yes. 850. And in front, you're out on the phone. 3850 the front row. At 3850 the bid. At 3850 the bid now. 3850 the bid now buys now. We're gonna be 3850. And in front. At 3850 here. 3850 the bid now buys now. We're gonna be 3850. What do you reckon? At 3850 here. At 3850 the bid now. You're in front. Dudley there. We're gonna be 3850. Floor bidder here. At 3850 now. And we're selling it out. We go. At 3850 now. You're gonna own this one today. At 3850. Last chance on the phone. I'm gonna sell it out. 3850. And out we go. Yes. 4050 on the phone. 4,050, we're selling. 4,000 now. At 4,050, the bid now, we're going to bid 450 on, on the phone. At 450 now. And selling it out, we go. At 450, the bid now, last chance. I'll take it. 200 remedy a quarter. Come on, Dudley, do you want it? At 4,050 4, here. At 4,050, the bid now, I'm getting ahead of myself. 4,050 here, last call. We're all over and done. Finish. Time out the floor. Time out online. <laughs> Sold phone better. Thank you. 4,050. And roll through and over to Toby. Jeez. Where's how, the next one? How popular are these Beatles? So we'll have another one for you. Lot number 30. Uh, couldn't make it here today. 1956 Volkswagen Beetle. It's the rear wheel drive sedan. Um, only indicating 52,000, just over 52,000 miles. It is the restorer's dream. Runs and drives. Uh, just a, probably a light restoration needed to get it up to the, uh, the perfect scratch you need it to be. But it is, it is the perfect restorer's dream. Um, as I said, ever popular. These things will just be popular forever. So grab one while it's cheap. Bill. These VW Beetles, they're just so popular, aren't they? We've got them springing up everywhere. <laughs> they certainly are. There was lots of them brought into Australia, uh, Ben. Well, they, uh, they actually built them here, didn't they? Didn't they, they have a factory in uh, Victoria or something? Yes, you're yeah. right. Um, mate, these are certainly, uh, they've got a cult following. Yeah. Um, this is a great example. But um, I just remember, you know, in the 70s, mm. these things were everywhere. Oh, yeah. And this is an oval window as well, which is uh, one of the ones which is quite uh, desirable, I believe. Yes, the very early one. Yeah. Uh, I didn't notice that myself. Yeah. Oh, yeah. There we go. Over window, yeah. Um, yeah, certainly great. Uh, but um, these things have actually taken off in value oh. over the last 12 months. Absolutely. They're a great collectible car. Um, so why don't we go back to the blocks and see how it goes. 66.50 now, the two horse race. Can he have another one there? We're going to bid 66.50. At 66.50 now. On the beetle there, Demise now. We're going to bid 66.50. That's like Herbie. Have a look at it there. We're going to bid 66.50 here. At 66.50 now. Look for three to play. At 66.50, the Demise now. We're going to bid 66.50. We're all over and done. At 66.50 now. At 66.50, the bid. We're all finished and done. 66.50, last chance. Time out the floor. Thank you. Refer him in online buyer there. Thank you. 66.50, online buyer. And Thank we're you. over to you, Toby. We've got another one. It's deja vu. We got another 1956 Volkswagen Beetle. It is also finished in black. Um, again, it's perfect for a light resto. So get in now before it's gone. It's indicating uh, a few lower Ks here, 13,000 miles uh, in manual. Uh, as I said, finished in black, the rear wheel drive sedan. Uh, car even comes with its original hubs and wheels. So it's great for those looking for a real. And Bill, here we have another Beetle and another oval window Beetle. What a cool looking thing this is. Yeah, it is. Uh, mate, how popular was the last one? Mm, absolutely. Someone's going to get an absolutely fantastic car. I mean, 
Yeah, go ahead. Yep, no, they will. Uh, as I said, this one, uh, someone will probably take it home. I think they'll probably leave it the way it is. This is what I was going to say. Would you restore it? Bill, if you bought this, would you restore it or would you keep it as it is? No, nah, mate, I'd leave it the way it is. Really? I would restore it. I'd, I'd you know, paint it blue and white and different colours and all sorts of things. And Would you put the number 53 sticker on it? How did you guess? And call it Herbie? <laughs> mate, uh, no, certainly I'd leave it the way it is. Mate, uh, these, these older cars with uh, great patina, yep. mate, uh, I think they'll increase in value more than... Uh, oh the restored cars so mate if it was my call and my car I'd leave it the way it was I think you're right there Bill let's go back to the uh, podium and see what the car makes Come on, it's better than that. At 7.9, at 7.9, they bid. Shelby got double eight. At 7,900 now. At 7,900 bucks, have been there buyers now. We're going to bid 7.9 here. At 7.9 now, we all over and done. At 7,900 and done. Finish. Time out the floor. Thank you. 7.9. Referred online better again. Thank you. Same way. And we're back over to you, Lee. Thank you. All right, time, time to bring some winners forward. Uh, congratulations, Ashley Online. We're about to draw your prize. So, Ashley Online wants draw number 18 opened, Ryan. So draw you... number 18. Yes, please. Draw number 18. And we've got Ashley Tracy Online. here as well. So, Tracy, if you'd come with me and we can find draw number 18 here. It'll be down here somewhere. There's 17. So, hopefully, 18 is going to be hiding below that one. Oh, amazing. It is. If you'd like to draw that out for us and open it for the viewer at home. And it is. Ooh. Hang on. A hundred dollar voucher. Beautiful. So that's for our viewer at home. And which draw would you like? Um, have we got 34? 34. It should be back down here. They mix them all up just to make me walk around the neck of this. There we go. There's... Oh, you got the f that's it, guys. Congratulations. Thank you. No worries. Thanks very much. Thank you. Doke. Now, have a look at this. 1955. So that makes it 63 years old. Thank God for that. Something older than me. Um, anyone remembers the Leyland Brothers? That's enough out of you, Kevin. Thank you. Anyone remembers the Leyland Brothers? This is what they first started out in old Land Rovers. Now, I can tell you one thing about Land Rovers. These early model Land Rovers overseas in Europe are going crazy. And this is all, no jokes aside, these things in mint restored condition are getting $100 plus thousand dollars for them. They're going crazy. This one's had a paint. I wouldn't say it's had a resto. It's because it's got a few dints and scratches. But it's got a good bones, good chassis. The top's been uh, refurbed. It's very good. But they are very, very collectible. Early series Land Rovers, there's a lot of people wanting them. So... Hopefully someone wants to get this one and take it home and have some fun with it. I'll pass it back to you, Lee. Thank you, Ryan. Looks in great condition. We've got an online bid of $16,000. Cheap at that. Let's go to auction. She'll be all over it. Looking for 500 to play. You get amongst this one here today, buyers. 16,000 to go. 16,000 opening bid there online there, buyers. Now we've got a bit 16 here. Looking for a half. At 16 now. At $16,000 now. At 16, the bid looking for five. Who's got it here? At 16,000 now. Have a look at it there. At 16,000. At 16,000, the bid now looking for another five. Come on, who's got it to play now? We've got a bid $16,000. At 16 now. The bid is on the net. Online buy now today. Now we've got a bid 16 here. At 16 now. Who's got a monkey? Come on. At 16 thousand now at 16 the bit now 16 the bit now we're gonna bid sixteen thousand dollars at 16 now at 16 the bit now we all over and done at 16 thousand last call finish on the floor sixteen thousand time him out thank you referred online bidder and rolling through thanks and Kevin. we're back over to you ryan what do we get next mate uh very very nice little 944 porsche here this car comes with an absolute it'd take you three weeks to read the receipts and all the uh, servicing on this vehicle. It's got a very, very comprehensive history with it. He's also uh, got the factory alloys. It's got aftermarket ones on it, but comes with the factory jelly bean wheels with it as well. And it's a very, very good car. Like, it presents nicely. The trim's still in good nick. If I can get the door open here. Door trims are all good. The steering wheel and the top of the dash is still in very, very good order. It's a manual, which I reckon every Porsche should be. Uh, a good car. We sold a couple of, one of these a couple of weeks ago and it made huge money, and I think this one's even tidier, so... If someone wants a good entry-level Porsche and don't, not paying 50 or 60k, jump online and have a crack at this one. Very good car, good provenance about it, and they are sneaking up in value all the time. Back to you guys. Great advice. Thank you, Ryan. Showing 
Excellent value at $10,700. What's it worth? Righto. Let's have some fun here. Come on, on the Porsche there, buyers. Now we've got 10, 7 to kick it away. Looking for another 500 to go there, buyers. Now we've got a bit 10,700 here. 11, 2. Online. At 11, 2 now. At 11, 2. There, but now we've got a bit 11, 2. Wants to be 7 next. Looking for another 5 to play. 11,200 now. On the Porsche there, racing your red in colour. Have a look at it. We've got a bit 11,200 here. At 11, 2 now. And it's better than that. Come on, you should be all over it. At 11,200 here. At 11, 2. They've been out the bit is on, on, on the net there, buyers. Now we've got a bit 11, 2. 11,200. 11 2, they've been here. We're going to be 11 2. We're going to be 11 2. Look at our 5. Come on. 11 2 now. Who wants it? 11,200 here. Come on, it's better than that. You all know it. 11,200 now. And cheap. At 11 2, the bid. At 11 2, they've been here. We're going to be 11,200 here. 11 2, come on. Come on, we're going to be 11,200 here. 11 2 now. Did you get all of that? 11,200 here. 11 2, they've been here. We all over and done. Come on, 11,200 here. Last chance. 11 2, they've been here. We all over and done. Finished 11 2. Thank you, time that went out 11 2. Better than that. Rolling through there, boys. And we're back to Lee. We get another prize. All right, time to draw another in-house raffle ticket. So thank you, everybody, for your support and sticking around for such a great auction. We've got uh, classic bikes coming up, do not forget. So a big day at our auction, so we've got lots of hundreds and hundreds of dollars to give away. Kevy. And keep an eye out for our roaming staff giving away the raffle tickets, guys. So if you don't have a raffle ticket yet, make sure you wave them down. Uh, lots of prizes. We've got green ticket, F63, Rose. Rose, if you're here, come and see our friendly staff at the front. That's not Good Ryan, you, that's Rose. Nathan. Rose, if you come forward, we'll, Thanks, uh, we'll get on with the auction in a couple of lots of time and draw the Stand prizes. Stand over here next to uh, friendly, go. smiling Nathan. Okay. Have a look at over this. you right. 99 Porsche Boxster S, Australian delivered, with logbooks, travelled 70,000 kilometres from you. I've never seen one in such pristine condition. 70,000 kilometres only, a lot of car for the money. It's got the uh, bigger series factory alloys on it, but uh, very, very low kilometres and picture perfect. Have a look at it. It's all standard, carpets are great, uh, grey leather interior, convertible. Uh, these are a great little car. They were very uh, underestimated when they first released them, but now they're getting a following. And this is probably one of the nicest ones on the market in Australia today. So I'll pass it back to you, Lee. A lot of beautiful red cars coming through today. We've got an online bid on the Porsche, $17,500. Right, Let's go. Let's kick it away. 17.5, opening bid there online there, buyers. Now looking for another 500 to go. On the gorgeous Porsche there. Who wants to be 18 on the floor? 18, yes, we got yes. it. On the phone. At 18 now, come on, be a half now. We've got a bit 18 on the phone. And in front. At 18,000. At 18,000. minute. Have a look at it. Absolute glamour. 18,000 here. At 18, the bid and buyers now. We've got a bit 18. Look at the five to play. 18 now. At 18, the bid. At 18, the bid and buyers now. We've got a bit 18. We've got a bit $18,000. At 18 now. 18, the bid. Come on, she's better than that. Five. Yes. 18, five. Up the back. Thank you there. We've got a bit 18, five. You're out on the phone. 18.5 now. 18.5 and in front. That's you there, mate. Now we're going to bid 18.5. 18.5. 18.5 and a half. 18 and a half the bid now, buyers. Now we're going to bid 18.5. 19. Yes. 19 and back. At 19 now. At 19 the bid now. We're going to bid 19. Come on, you need on the fire to play. At 19 now. Have a look at it. $19,000 now we got. At 19 the bid is on the phone. 19 now. Who's got another monkey to play? At 19 now. 19 the bid now, buyers. Now we're going to bid 19. We're going to bid $19,000. At 19 now. Do you want to be half? 19,000 here. Come on, have a look at it. You can't have one bid and walk away. At 19,000. He's on the phone at 19,000. 19,000. Come on, one more. 19,005. Yes. 195. Thank you. 195 up the back. At 195, the bid. 195, same courtesy to you on the phone there, buyers. Now we're going to bid 19 and a half. Ram into 20 and you be in the box seat. At 195. 195, the bid is with you. At 195 here. Thank you there, buyers. Now we're going to bid 195. At 19 now. Who wants to be 20? Come on. At 195. 19,500. It's gorgeous. Have a look at it there. 19,500 here. At 195, we're going to bid 1920. Yes. 20,000 at 20,000. I saw you all go, ah, oh, 20,000 here. 20,000, but he's on the phone. Come on, have a think about it there. We're going to bid $20,000 at 20,000 now. At 20,000 now, the bid now will take another five to go. At 20,000 here, 20 the bid. At 20, the bid is on the phone. There, buyers now. We're going to bid 20 here. At 20 now, 29 the bid now. 29 the bid now. We're going to bid $20,000 at $20,000. Come on. Last chance. $20,000. Another five. You never know. He's bleeding on the phone. $20,000. You're going to miss out for 500 bucks. It's a Porsche. $20,000 is on the phone. At $20,000 here. At $20,000. But you're going to kick yourself. $20,000 on the phone. At $20,000. We all have a none. $20,000 on the phone. And a half. 
20 and a half. Thank you, sir. We're going to be 20 and a half in the front row. We've got new blood in the game there, boys. Now we're going to be 20 and a half here. At 20 and a half, and you're in front. At 20 and a half here. 20,500 now, boys. Now we're going to be 20,000. Another five? 20,000's here. At 20,000, worth a try. 20,000 here. At 20,000, fire the banana buyers. Now we're going to be 20 and a half here. At 20 and a half here, yeah, on the phone. At 20 and a half here. 20,000, fire the banana. We're going to be 20,500. You're looking for another five to go. At 20,005. At 20,005, are we all over and done? At 20,500, the bid is in room. Yes. One. 21. 21 on the phone. 21 on the phone there, buyers. Now we're going to be $21,000. At 21, sir, can I tempt you another 500? 21,000's on the phone. Be a half. 21,000 is on the phone. Top bidder on the phone there, buyers. Now we're going to be 20,000. Have a look at yes. it. Five. Thank you, five. We're going to be 21,500. In front. At 21,500. 21,500. The bid is in the front row oh, there, the buyers. Push. Now we've got 21,500. At 21,500 now. At 21,500. Look at 22 next. At 21,500 here. And worth every single dollar. Have a look at it there. It's a glamour there, buyers. Now we've got 21,500. In the front row. What do you reckon on the phone there, buyers? Now we're going to be 21,500. 21,500. And in front. In room buyer. At 21,500. At 21,500. The bid we've got 21,500 here. Are you all over and out on the phone? At 21,500 is with me here. At 21, I'm going to time him out. 21,500. Are we all over and done? You sure, guys? 21,500. We're finished. Time out the phone. Time out online. Thank you. And so that is referred to you. Thank you for your bid and your bidder's number. What's your bidder's number there, mate? Sorry. Oh, you've got it? Thanks, Perfect. Gary. Thank you. Roll that one through there, boys. We're back over to Ryan with the next one. Thank you there, guys. Mate, uh, that little boxer, that's gorgeous. 70 Ks. Hey, uh, have a look at this combi coming through. 73 model. And uh, very, very nice. Had a full resto. Engine was rebuilt in 2002. Uh, all the trim's been done. It's got a little bed in the back. Uh, very, very nice sound system in it. But uh, just great colour combo. Very, very nicely uh, done. White wheels with the chrome hubcaps look good. And uh, as we all know, everyone loves combis. And this is a very, very nice presented one. Uh, and uh, n virtually nothing to spend. Put some rego on it and enjoy it. Drive it, for the, uh, drive it for the rest of your life. Beautiful. Back to you, Lee. Thanks very much, Ryan. Great combi for the Gold Coast. I'd love to, let it, uh, love to see it stay here on the coast and driving around on the roads by the beaches. We've got an online bit of 22,500. What's it worth, Kev? Right, yeah, it's a gorgeous looking combi too. If you're in the front row, just stand up on your seat there, guys, if you want to have a crack at this one. We've got 22,500 to open this one up today, buyers. Now we're going to be $22,500 on the combi here at 22 and a half. We've got three and a half online. 23.5 at 23.5. Can you refresh that, please, for me? 23.5 at 23.5. We have some technical difficulties. 23.5, we've got at 23.5. The bit is on the net. At 23.5 at 23.5. The bit is on the net there, buyers. Now we've got $23,500 here at 23.5 now. At 23.5. Looking for another 500. Anyone wants this one today? Yeah, we've got to be 23.5. 23.5 and go. At 23.5. At 23.5. The bit there, buyers. Now we've got to be 23.5. 23.500. The bit on the combi there, buyers. Now we've got to be 23.5. Who wants to be four? 23,500 here. Have a look at it. It's gorgeous. 23,500 here and better than that. At 23,500. 23,500. They've been all over and done. At 23,500. 23,500 there, buyers. Now we're going to be 23,500. At 23,500. Last chance. 23,500. Are we finished? Done on the floor. Close him off. Thank you. 23,500. We'll refer that in. Roll it through there, boys. Online bidder. 23,500. Back over to Toby, mate. What have we got next? Another combi. Up next, lot 35. Ryan said it well. Everybody loves combis. How about a combi you? The transporter pickup, the 1957 transporter, uh, indicating just over 60,000 miles. It is the four-cylinder petrol, four-speed manual, finished in blue. Um, look, it's the Australian built. Billy, we've got an absolutely fantastic combi split window ute coming up here. I had a good look at this uh, on paper the other day and just the more I read of it, the more I loved it. It's a fantastic little, little car, isn't it? Mate, it is. Uh, mate, Australian delivered, 57 model. It's yep. done 60,000 miles. Mm. Um, it went to a farm, mm. had a lot of farm use in mm -hmm. its early days. Current owners owned it for 22 years. Mm. Uh, mate, there's a little bit of rust around it, but uh, mate, where do you find them like this? Absolutely, and most of that is just patina, isn't it? I mean, you look on the bumpers, they look rusty, but they're still all there. They're solid. It's just, a, uh, uh, just on the surface of the bumper. But uh, six volt as well, original six volt system still in place, new six volt battery in it, so you don't see them that original. No, you don't, uh, mate. I would have to say that this would, mate, 
I think you'd go harder to find a more original one than this. Yep. Uh, I think this will surprise everyone. Yeah. Well, we've had a lot through in the last few months, uh, but nothing this original. This is just a fantastic looking thing, and someone's going to absolutely adore this, I'm sure. Yep, they will. How about we go back to the blocks and see what it makes? At 36.5, we finish. Come on, 36,500 and done. Time out the floor, thank you. Online better there, 36,500. And back over to you, Lee. Thank you. With our next prize. Yes, uh, Rose is here with me. And Rose, Rose, what number would you like? I think I'll go for 14. Number 14. Okay, if we walk down this way. 10, 12, 13. Here we go. Number 14, if you'd like to grab the envelope. The envelope's better than the... Better than the chook or the dice, yep. <laughs> Here we go. Might be a box of matches. No, we wouldn't do that to you. Hmm. And you have won... The oh, chicken. you've won a chicken. Congratulations, you can feed that to hubby tonight. Hopefully he doesn't choke on any bones. Well, Come and see us after the auction. <laughs> Thanks very much. Okay, have a look at this little speech to coming through. <laughs> He's having a go at me about his chook. Um, now, this is a replica of this speedster, 356. Genuine ones of these worldwide at the moment are demanding anywhere between 300 to a million dollars. Genuine ones, matching numbers, correct ones. This is a replica, and I don't think the gentleman that owns it is looking for 300 or a million dollars, but it's a very, very good replica. They look so much like the real car. They run the same wheelbase. They run a 1600 engine. Uh, this one's left-hand drive, can be registered in Australia. I think it ha already has been registered in Queensland. And it's, uh, it's a, they're a great looking car and they do drive good because they're only light and the 1600 engine pushes along quite well. And th this is a good example. And uh, even if you want to do a colour change, I know a few guys that have bought these speeds and they'll have them black for a couple of years and they'll paint them silver because it's very easy to recolour them. You just take the trim out. But a good example, it is complied, it is ready to go, uh, and they're a lot of fun. Great car. Back to you, Lee. Thanks, Ryan. Uh, it's got to be impossible not to look cool in this one, as Joey's showing us right now. Well done, Joey. We've got an online bid of $31,500. Great value at that. Let's go to auction. Sounds cheap to me. 31.5. Who's going to throw another 1,000 at it? Come on now, Ivany Myers. Now we're going to be 31,500 here at 31.5. 31.5. The speeds of their buyers. Now we're going to be 31,500 here. 31 and a half. At 31 and a half. The buyers. Now we're going to be 31.5. Have a look at it there. At 31.5. 31.5. Now you're going to be 2.5. Who wants it here today? At 31.5. 31.5. The bid. At 31.5. Now we're going to be 31 and a half. At 31.5. 31.5. The bid. And he's in front there online. Their buyers. Now we're going to be 31. 1,500 here at 31.5. At 31.5, she's better than that. Come on. At 31.5. At 31.5. At 31.5, everybody buys here. We're going to be 31,500 here. Come on, can I tempt anyone for another grand? You never know. At 31.5. At 31.5, everybody now. 31.5, now we all haven't done. 31,500 here. We finish. At 31.5 and done. Time out of the floor. Thank you. Roll that one through there, boys. 31.5. Back over to you, Ryan. Thank you. The next slot. Yeah, mate. A little bit of America coming through here. Uh, Cadillac Eldorado, 83 model. And uh, very striking car. It's in like a gunmetal metallic. Uh, these were the front-wheel drive Cadillacs. A little bit different in the uh, in the design on these one. But uh, this is a good car. It's been in Australia for many, many years. Uh, have a look at that right-hand drive. Look at the length of these doors. It's got all the timber look finish, leather seats. Um, and a pretty cool-looking car, actually. I reckon they're a great-looking car. These short boot on them. So if you're worried about having a big long wheelbase Cadillac, this is a shorty, so it's a lot easier to park. But uh, Great car, great driver's car. Back to you, Lee. Thanks, Ryan. I can see you in one of these. We've got an online bid of $7,750, we'll call it. All right, Let's chase go another three to go there, boys. 7,007, the bid opening bid online there, boys. Now we're going to bid 7, 7 here. At 7, 7, the bid is on the net. At 7, 7 now. Looking for eight next here, boys. Now we're going to bid 7,700 bucks and go. On the Eldorado. 7, 7 here. At 7, 7, the bid, boys. Now we're going to bid 7,700 bucks. At 7, 7 now. At 7, 7, the bid. Now we're going to bid 7, 7 now. We're going to bid 7,700 now. At 7,700 bucks. Come on, she's better than that. At 7,700 here. At 7, 7, the bid. At 7, 7, the bid. Now 7, 7, the bid. And we all haven't done. 7, 7. 7,700. Come on, done. Finish. Tommy, thank you. 7 7 online. 7733 online buyer. Thank you. And back to Lee. All right. Time to draw some more winners. We've got, uh, thank you very much to Liam Groves of Victoria. Another one from Victoria. So thank you again for your support. We'll be, uh, we'll be coming down south to Bathurst on the, 20, on the 31st of this month. So we're on, we're on the road. That's next weekend for an, uh, for an auction. 
So um, Liam, you come back to us in two cars time with the draw number and we'll be happy to draw your prize. There's still some big ticket items in those drawers so make sure you um, stay with us and uh, come back to us with the draw number. And Kevy, we're going to draw the next in-house raffle prize winner. Surely we're out of frozen chickens. We've got green ticket F52. Green ticket F52. F52. That's Stu, if you'd like to come forward and see Ryan or Nathan, we'll draw the prizes shortly. Let's go back to auction. Okay, guys, thanks for that. This is, uh, this is straight out of Jukes of Hazard. This thing, have a look at it. Chev K10. So it's a four wheel drive running a 350 engine. Uh, it's got a three speed automatic in it. And. Uh, Big set of wheels, short wheelbase, which I reckon looks better than the long ones in these things. Uh, still left-hand drive, bronze metallic, and I like the front of these. These are the big thing in the States back in the 70s and 80s with these KC spotlights. Well, still got the covers on it. They're pretty faded, but it's all there. Little nudge bar on the front. And uh, if you're in the, into American pickups, it's well worth having a look at this vehicle. It's, it's not a bad old truck. Take it home, spend a bit of money on it and uh, you'd have a good driver. I'll pass it back to you guys. Thank Thanks, you. Ryan. A lot of car there for $8,500 current online bid. Let's go to auction, Kevy. Sounds cheap to me. Eight and a half to open this one up today. Hands should be everywhere here. We've got a bit eight and a half. Looking for another three to play. Eight and five. They're having a bit of online there, boys. Now we've got a bit eight five. Eighty five hundred bucks and go. At eighty five the bid. Eighty five the bid. We're eight and a half on the on the okay. chef there now with the GMC. Then we've got a bit eight five. Eighty five hundred bucks and go. Eighty five the bid. It's cheap. Come on. Eight five now. At eighty five the bid. At eighty five the bid. Now eighty five the bid. Now eighty five wants to be eighty eight on the floor. Eighty five now. Eighty five hundred bucks now on cheap. Eighty five here. We all haven't done. Eighty five hundred bucks. She's better than that. Eight Eight five and done. Tommy, thank you. Eight five. Can't settle without roll them through there, boys. Back over to Ryan. Uh, next one coming. It's another Chev, but uh, a lot later model. Uh, this is a '99, and this is a pretty cool looking car. All in white. It looks stunning. Really does. Massive set of chrome wheels. I think that must be 19s or God knows what size they are. But this is a very, very nice car, and someone spent a lot of money on it. Uh, all the interior's been done in uh, like a creamy leather, and I think. If uh, this is the one with the suicide doors on it, I'll just, yes it is, there we go, have a look at that. So three in the back, three in the front, so it's a six seater, suicide doors and a great looking truck. These are, these are pretty cool, these things, I got to drive one of these back in the late 90s and I thought I was king of the kids. Great thing, this one presents very well, it's, it's right hand drive, fully complied. Uh, ready to work or play and, and uh, hopefully go to a great home. Back to you guys. Alright, thank you Ryan. The online bidding has been rising. We've got $17,500. Again, should What's be everywhere. 17,500. Opening bid was to be 18 next. At 17,500 here. 17,500 opening bid now. We've got a bid 17 and a half. Looking for another five to play. At 17,500 now. 17,500 and cheap. At 17,500 now. We've got a bid 17 and a half. At 17,500 now. At 17,500. Looking for 18 to go now, buyers. Here we've got a bid 17 and a half. At 17 and a half here. At 17 and a half. Now. Come on, who's got five to throw out it here today? We've got a bid 17,500 now. At 17,500. 17 and a half. At 17 and a half here. At 17,500 now. 17,500. Come on, she's better than that. 17,500. We all over done at 17,500 finished thank you time out the floor there 75 online bit of there and roll it through there boys when you're ready back over to you Ryan what have we got next uh, mate this one um, Lee's talking about giving to me this as a new company car Fantastic. Uh, have a look at this Mustang V8 supercharge it's got a yellow Terra supercharger on it which is an Australian company it's been around for many many years yellow Terra used to make the uh, the heads on the six cylinder Holdens back in the day this is stunning. It's got 700 plus horsepower. I'd get to work on time. That's a bonus. Uh, manual gearbox. It is an Australian complied and delivered Mustang and just absolutely stunning. The yellow colour is gorgeous. It's had a brake upgrade, exhaust, supercharged, uh, different wheels, bigger wheels obviously, and just absolutely stunning. We won't start it inside the building because everyone uh, would lose their fillings in their teeth because it sounds that good. It's like a, it made it. I love the car. Beautiful. Let's see it go to a good home. Back to you guys. All right, Ryan, thank you. It would be hard not to turn heads in this one. We've got an online bid of $46,000. All 
What's it worth? Right, oh, no. sounds cheap to me. Forty-six thousand dollars now. Take a grand to go on this one here today. Come on, three end up in the air at forty-six here. Forty-six thousand dollars now. The staying there by us now. We're gonna bid forty-six here at forty-six now. Forty-six to bid. Come on, she's better than that. Come on, you should be all over now. We're gonna bid forty-six thousand dollars now at forty-six to bid. Forty-six to bid in by us now. Come on, it was to be seven on the floor there by us now. We're gonna bid forty-six here at forty-six yeah. seven. Forty-seven. Thank you there, sir. Now we're gonna bid forty-seven and in front at forty-seven here at forty-seven. Two more right there by us now. We're gonna bid forty-seven and in front at forty-seven thousand dollars. Now I'll take another grand if anyone else wants to join in here at 47 now. 47 the bid at 47 the bid now. We're gonna bid 47. We're gonna bid 47 here. It's supercharged. Have a look at it there. $47,000 now at 47 here. How cheap is this today? At 47,000 at 47 the bid. $47,000 a bid now, boys. Come on, can I tempt anyone else at 47,000? We all over and done. $47,000 a bid now. We finish. $47,000 are we done? Last call on the floor. 47. Time him out. Thank you. 47,000. Time me out when you're ready there, thank you. That's referred to you there, sir. What's your bidder's number there, mate? Excuse me, mate. What was your bidder's number there, mate? Yep. Can you read that out, That'll to us, Nathan? One, two, two, zero, two, seven. Thank you. Mate. Thank you. Thank you there, sir. Okay, and we're back over to Lee with another raffle prize. Alright. No. Online win. So raffle draw, Ryan. Have we got a yes. winner for the raffle draw? Yes. Yep. Come with me. This lovely young lady just turned up. What draw number would you like? 42. 42. <laughs> right down the bottom here. <laughs> there you go, madam. If you'd like to grab the envelope out and open up for us. It could be a chook. It could be, uh, it could be anything in this envelope, actually. We're not sure. Let's have a look what you've won. And you've won... A $50 cash voucher. Thank you very much. Come and see us after the auction's over. Thank you. Okay. This would have to be the biggest horsepower car in the building. 1,600 horsepower. This thing is an absolute monster. The gentleman who built this car spent over 2,000 hours building it. The paintwork is absolutely spot on. The powertrain is incredible. Twin turbocharged. This thing is absolutely gorgeous. It would have to be, have a look at this, still left-hand drive, which I reckon is the only way to go with American muscle cars, but absolutely gorgeous. Brakes, transmissions, all been beefed right up. The, engine, the powertrain in this was over a $100,000 build. It is absolutely fantastic. It's won many trophies, and it is gorgeous. So if someone wants a real bit of tough American iron that goes like a, what is it, something off of Shanghai? I can't remember the expression. This is the car for you. I'll, uh, I'll pass it back to the gentleman up in the uh, box. Thanks, Lee. <laughs> Thank you, Ryan. We have an online bid of $63,000. That's not even what the suspension cost on what this thing. What do you thing. reckon? Here we go. $63,000 to kick this one away. Who's got two to play? $63,000 now. You've got to be $65,000 be in the box seat. At sixty-seven. I like it. $67,000. At $67,000. We're out near by us now. Come on, it's worth every single dollar and more. At sixty-seven now, still looking for another two grand to play. At sixty-seven, the bid. Sixty-seven, the bid. Now have a look at their buyers now. Come on, we're going to bid sixty-seven thousand dollars here. At sixty-seven now. At sixty-seven, the bid in buyers now. We're going to bid sixty-seven thousand. The bid is on the net. Seventy-one. Seventy-one online. At seventy-one now. At seventy-one, the bid now. Seventy-one, the bid now. We're going to bid seventy-one thousand dollars now. Look at another two to play. At seventy-one, the bid. At seventy-one, the bid in buyers now. We're going to bid seventy-one to go. At seventy-one here. At seventy-one, the bid now. There's on the net. There buyers now. We're going to bid seventy-one thousand dollars now. Come on, take a two grand to go. At seventy-one now. At seventy-one, the bid now buyers now. We're going to bid seventy-one. Have a look at it there. At seventy-one thousand dollars now. At seventy-one, are we all over and done? At seventy-one, come on, she's better than that. Seventy-one thousand dollars. Last chance on the floor. Seventy-one thousand. Time I one out there. Thank you. Seventy-one thousand. Refer me online. Rolling through there, boys. Back over to Ryan. Thank you. Hey, uh, yeah, mate. This is an Aussie built one. This is a nineteen eighty Valiant sedan and have a look at the paint on it. Whoever's built this car spent a fortune on it. It's got uh, well wheels on it, mural up the side and it is, it's a gorgeous old Val. I've never seen one that's had that much money spent on it and I'll give you a little peek under the bonnet. Uh, under the bonnet is absolutely, if we can get the bonnet popped here and I can find the latch, that's always a good uh, test. I've got it. Look at this. Straight six Hemi engine, big four barrel carby on it, it's got roller rockers, the guy spent a monster on it and an absolute rocket ship. Every, anyone remembers back in the early 70s, these straight six Valiant engines were in the chargers and they were massive horsepower these to get out of these things. Very strong motor, very torquey engine. And uh, this is a very, very nice old car. So if you're a Mopar lover 
or you want a bit of Australian classic car, jump online and have a crack at this Valiant. Definitely worth a look and uh, spent, the guy has spent a fortune on it and done a great job and it deserves to go to a new home. Back to you, Lee. Yeah, thank you, Ryan. I'd like to take this opportunity to anyone who's joined us uh, just now online. Uh, we're having a lot of fun here in Carrara. A lot of cars have sold under the hammer, streaming on Facebook, YouTube, and on the website. Uh, thank you for, uh, for joining us, and I um, hope you enjoy the action coming up shortly. And we're at lot number 42. The online bid is $14,600. Let's go to auction, Kev. Rightio. Looking for 500 to play on this one here today, guys. Now we've got a bid 14.6 to go. 14.6 opening bid online. Their buyers down cheaper. Now we've got a bid 14.6. 14.6 now. B15 one next. At 14. 15.6. 6, we got. At 15.6 now. I like it there. Now 16, we've got a bid 16.6. 6. Here we go. At 16.6 6 now. 16.6 6 a bit. Now we've got a bid 16,600 now. On the regal there. Have a look at it there. We've got a bit 16.6. 6. 17. 17.6. 17,600 now. 18.1 yes. on the phone. 18.1. 18.1 18, 18, on the bid now. 18.6 18, 6 back. 18.6 6 back now, buyers. Now we've got a bit 18.6 online. At 18.6 6 now. 18,006 a bit now. 18.6 6 a bit. I'll take it to the 5 to go. 18,600 the bid. At 18.6 6 now. 18,600 now. Come on, you're back on the phone there. We've got a bit 18.6. 18, 6. 18 yeah. 6. 19 1. 19,100 now. 19 1 the bid. On the phone. At 19 1. At 19 1 the bid. You're out online there, buyers. Now we've got a bit 19,100 now. At 19 1. 19,100 now. Have a look at it there, buyers. Now we've got a bit 19 1. At 19 1 now. 19,100 now. Who's got another half to go? At 19 1. 19,100 on the bid now, buyers. Now we've got a bit 19 1. At 19 1. On the phone. 19 6. 19 6. Thank you there, buyers. Now we've got a bit 19,600 here. At 19 6. On the phone. Two phone bidders there, buyers. Now we've got a bit 19 6. At 19 6 here. At 19 6 the bid. 19,600 the bid now. Is he out online? 19,600 here. At 19 6 the bid. 19,600 the bid there, buyers. Now we've got a bit 19 6. At 19 6 and in front. On the phone there. At 19 6 the bid. Take another 500 to go there, buyers. Now we've got a bit 19 6. At 19 6. Come on. At 19 19,600 the bid. Are we all over and done? At 19,6. At 19,6 the bid. Come on, last chance. 19,600. We finished. All done. 19,6. Time him out online. Thank you. 19,6. When you're ready there, mate. Time him out. Uh, that's the phone bidder there referred. Thank you. Rolling through the boys. And back over to Lee. In house winner. All right. So for those. For those of us that have just joined us online or here at Carrara, uh, we've got a lot of fantastic opportunities in the form of an online and live raffle. Um, so uh, if you don't have a raffle ticket, we've got some roaming staff, make sure you get one. Um, we have William J from Melbourne. So if you're out there, William, watching the live stream, you're, uh, you're the next in line for a prize. So over the next two cars, you've got to come back to us and let us know what draw you'd like us to open on your behalf. Still thousands of dollars to go. William J, come back to us soon. And for the in house, everybody in house, get your raffle tickets ready. That's you, Kev. We have a wiener. <laughs> All right, purple ticket A98. That's Phil. Purple ticket A98. Come forward and see Nathan out the front, and we'll uh, we'll, we'll call the prize shortly. For now, well, let's go back to auction. Alrighty, thank you, Lee. Lot number 43, up next, going up as we speak, we've got a 1971 Valiant VG hardtop. Um, so it's the, the hardtop coupe there, uh, indicating just over 60,000 Ks, the six cylinder petrol. It has a musical air horn. Oh, I wish it was here, I'd love to hear it. Oh, yes. oh I would love to hear it. Unfortunately, it didn't, it's not rolling through today. Um, it's also got a roll of black carpet it's, uh, to be fitted into the car that comes with it. Now, the 18 inch rim there. So, Ben, uh, coming up now, we've got the first of the Valley, oh no, the second Valley in across the blocks. We That's had right. one just earlier, a Regal. This is a VG, uh, made a great cruising car, this one. Um, you've had a look at it, what do you think? Absolutely, mate. And these things are only going one way and that's up. Um, you know, the, the 70s was such a great time for design in Australia for cars, and this just bears all the hallmarks of that era. You know, those slab sided sort of lines, long bonnet. Great looking coupe. I think Valiant's in, you know, I think they did some of the best coupes beside the, uh, the X8 or XC Falcons, which I adore. I think this is probably their second best, yeah. along with the Charger. Mate, the I'd, ha mm. I'd have to agree with mm. you there. Mm. Getting back to the uh, the 70s stuff there, mm. musical air horns on it, they tell me. <laughs> you remember that? Uh, probably La Cucaracha or something, isn't it? La Cucaracha, yeah, that's yeah. the only one I remember. Yeah, exactly. remember but uh, they were certainly a hit of the 70s, weren't yeah, they? Yeah, well, it wouldn't be Mr. Whippy, would it? No. <laughs> Absolutely not. How about we fly back to the blocks and see how it goes? This is a genuine 69 VF Pacer Survivor car. You will not find another 
Isis yellow survivor car in this condition in Australia. That's the, uh, it's the genuine rare factory colour, Isis yellow. Not too many are made. We believe there's about 10 cars left in Australia with this colour. Um, it's had a reconditioned gearbox, new clutch, brakes have been reconditioned, the radiator, and a freshened motor with a four-barrel carby and a factory air cleaner. So it's had some work done. It is rare as hen's teeth. You won't find another one in this condition in Australia. Offered up at Lloyd's today. Do not miss your chance. Lee? All right, thanks, Toby. We've, the online bidding has been rising rapidly. We're at an online bid of 17,500. Righto. Seven and a half to kick this one away. B18, you'll be in the box seat here today, Bias. Now we're going to bid 17 and a half. 17 and a half to kick this one away. At 17 and a half, who's got five to play now today? Now, Bias, now we're going to bid 17 five. At 17 five now. 17 five now. Look at a half, Bias. Now we're going to bid 17 five. 17,000. So, Ben, we mm. just saw the uh, the VG Valiant go over the blocks, made great money. But look what we got up next. We got a 69 Valiant Pacer. I love these cars, mate. Slane 6, 225. Uh, it's got matching numbers uh, engine and gearbox, it says. Very rare colour, Isis Yellow. This is just too cheap for what this car is. Someone's going to get an absolute bargain on this. I want to put my hand up myself, Bill. <laughs> yeah, look, the bidding it was a see there, 17,500 is cheap. Great yeah. example there. Mate, these are highly sought after now. Oh. The uh, As the Holdens and Fords are taken off, I don't think the Valiants have really followed us. They've kept up with them. They, they're not where they should be. I'll put it that way. They should be a lot more than what they are. So they make an absolutely fantastic uh, buy in the Australian market. Uh, and a great alternative to the uh, the Holden and the Fords. And, you know, Chrysler people, they, they love these cars, and I love this car. I'm a Ford guy, I love this car too. Fantastic thing. Look, take a look at it. Uh, this is another one you'd leave the way it is and just uh, keep it as a driver, mate. I think, uh, mate, if I was a betting man, I think this thing will only go up one way. Oh. It'll go up in value. Um, it certainly won't go down. There's absolutely no doubt about it. And that's what we're seeing about these Australian cars as well. They represent an absolutely fantastic investment. And it's a, a tangible asset you can enjoy and you can drive it and you can have some great fun with it. And it's going to go up. Absolutely. How about we go back to the blocks and see how it goes? At 18.5 the bid, 18.5 the come on, we all over and done at $18,500, done, time out, thank you, referred online by there, 18.5, and back to you Ryan, what have we got next? Mate, another Valiant Chrysler supercar, E55 Charger, these cars were built to go up against the Phase 4 Falcon and the uh, XU1 V8 Tirana, but um, Evan Green and his wisdom got on the cover of, the, I think it was the Melbourne Age, and told everyone that if young people are going to buy these cars, they're going to go out and kill themselves, so they all got canned. The Phase 4 Falcon got canned, the V8 Tirana, and the Bathurst Charger, V8 Charger, got canned. So Ford and, and uh, Chrysler and Fulham, just all the parts already produced for these vehicles, slipped them down the production line in bits and pieces in different cars. Well, this is running the 340 V8, high, high output engine, um, and a good survivor, good solid car. You look under the bonnet of this thing, and have a look at that, very original. So look at the old fireball sticker on the, uh, on the air cleaner. Got air conditioning. Have a look at the size of the compressor. That would run the air on the Queen Mary, that thing. But a good, tidy survivor charger. And like even the worst Valiant charger in the world, we've seen them making 30 and 40 grand crazy money. This is a good example, and it's a very, very rare one. Uh, factory mag's still on it too, which is unusual. You, back in the day, everyone used to put different wheels on them, big hot wire wheels or something like that. This is still running the factory deep dish Chrysler mags on it and, uh, and just a classic car and you've got to love the vinyl on the side here. That's a factory by the way, that's not aftermarket, that plush vinyl. Uh, what a classic. Let's see it go to a good home. Back to you Lee. All right, thank you Ryan. These cars have a very passionate following. We've got an online bid of $84,000. What's right it going to go for? Let's kick it away. I'll chase two grand on this one here today, buyers. We've got 84 to kick it away. Online bit of there, buyers. Now we're going to bid $84,000 here. On the charger. Come on, now we're going to bid 84. Look at the six next. $84,000 here. Have a look at their buyers. Now we're going to bid 84 to go. 84, the bit online. 84, the bit is on the net there, buyers. Now come on, we're going to bid 84. Look at the two to play. Who's got 2,000 to throw at this one today? $84,000. At 84, the bid. At 84, the bid. Come on, she's better than that. Come on, now we're going to bid 84. 84 and go. At 84, the bit on the net there, buyers. Now come on, we're going to bid 84. Thousand dollars at eighty four now. What a lot of car. G'day, Bill. Eighty four thousand at eighty four now. Eighty four. The bit the buyers here. Come on, now we're gonna bid eighty four and go at eighty four here. Eighty four. The bit. Come on, who's got two to play? Eighty four thousand. Eighty four. The bit. Surely Ryan's got two. Come on. Eighty four thousand at eighty four. The bit. It's a lot of fun here today, buyers. Now we're gonna bid eighty four. Eighty four and go. Eighty four. The bit. Come on. At eighty four. The bit. Now buyers. Now we're gonna bid eighty four thousand dollars now. You own a bit of history. Eighty four thousand at eighty four here. Eighty four. The bit. Buyers. Now come on, we're gonna bid eighty four. It's a charger. Have a look at. 
better there. 84,000. At 84, the bid. Come on, she's better than that. 84 now. 84, the minute buyers now. Come on, it'll take a grand from anyone. Who's got it? 84 now. 84, the bid. Come on. At 84, bid there, buyers now. Come on, we get a bit. 84, round into five. We'll take it. 85. On the phone. Thank you. 85. 85,000. 85 on the phone there, buyers. 85. 85 here. I'll take another grand. Same courtesy to you on the floor. 85,000. At 85 now. She'll be all over it. $85,000 now. At 85, the bid. 85, the bid there, buyers. Now we've got about $85,000. Have a look at it. 85,000. At 85, the bid. Ronnie, you got something to tell me about it? You've got to look at one of these. I'd rather drive one of these V8 charges. And I know everyone loves the six packs with the triple carbs and everything. But these things were just such a great engine. They're a good, solid, high-performance engine. And it's a rare, rare car. And like, if this was a uh, GD Falcon or something sitting here, or an XU1, everyone would be jumping all over it. These cars are worth a lot of money, and they're going to go up in value. as They're increasing in value every day. We've seen that with, with all different sorts of uh, Chrysler products. This is a very, very good example. It's got, it's got the uh, big booster on it, um, and the engine is just as... It, came out of the factory. Just a good original old car. It hasn't had a full rest iron on it, this car. Still got the numbers in the chassis. Like, it's just a good, tidy old car. So, look, if you're at home and you want to have got a bit of superannuation money or something like that and you want to put it into something, they're not going to go down in value. That's one thing I can guarantee you. These cars aren't going to go down. They're going to go up. So you're going to get more return on your money in one of these than you will in the bank. So if you've got a bit of money at home and you want to put it in something, buy something like this. I can come around and drive it for you on the weekends. I really wouldn't mind. But a good classic car, very original car, and well worth the investment. Back to you guys. Well said, Ryan. It's gone up as you've been speaking, mate. We're at $87,000 now on the Charger. Eight Charger there. We've got a bit 87 to go. 87, come on. I'll still take another grand That's if you want it here on the floor. The bit is on the net at 87,000. Phone, you're out. 87 right. now. 87, the bit now. We've got a bit $87,000 now. Come on, it's a Charger. 87 now. 87, the bit the buyers now. Come on, we've got a bit 87 now. Take another grand. Anyone on the floor? Or the phone bidder if you want it there. 87 here. 87, the bit the buyers now. We've got a bit 87. Come on, last chance. 87,000. 87, the bit the buyers now. Come on, she's better. Better than that, and I'm going to time him out. 87 now. 87 the bid, you get him a sound. 87 now, last call for another thousand. You never know. 87 thousand dollars on the charger here today, boys. Now we get a bit of 87 thousand. Can we get another grand out of him on the phone? 87 thousand. At 87 the bid. 87 the bid. What does he reckon there? At 87 now, seeking some instructions. 87 thousand. He's talking to the bank manager. 87 thousand now. 90,000, I like it. At 90,000, the phone bit of there. $90,000 now. At 90,000 and in front. Online, you're out. 90,000, I like it. Blow him out of the water there. We're going to be $90,000 on the charger here. Take it down the two grand from here, buyers. Now we're going to be $90,000. At 90, the bid. $90,000 here. Anyone got any strips for me? $90,000 here. At 90, the bid. At 90, the bid. We're going to be $90,000 on the charger. Have a look at it there. We're going to be $90,000. That won't do the trick. $90,000. At 90, the bid. We're we're going to be 90, we're going to be 90,000 dollars now. Have a look at it there. I want to crack a ton on this one here today. 90,000, the bid is on the phone. Are we all over and done? At 90,000 dollars, are we done? Finished, last chance. 90,000 dollars on the charger. Done, finished. Time him out online, thank you. Phone bit of there referred at 90,000 dollars. Rolling through there, boys. Thank you very much. We're back over to Lee. All right, Ryan, time to give away some more cash, hopefully. Let's bring Phil up. Open the drawer. Mate, we've got this lovely gentleman here. He's always here with us at Lloyd's. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> and mate, what, what draw number would you like, sir? Oh, 25. 25, let's have a look. Yeah, no, nothing in there for you. Now, here you go. Grab the envelope. Open it up. Let's see what you want, mate. Come on. This could be it. This could be the big one. Oh, that's an easy way to do it. Here we go, and $100 cash, well done. Congratulations, sir, $100, well done. That'll buy you a couple of beers after the auction. I'll help you. <laughs> okay, next car coming through. Back to the guys. Thank, thank you, Ryan. Next up, lot 47, not rolling through today, is the Restorer's Dream. We've got a 1987 Ford Fairlane, uh, the Series ZL, four-door sedan. Uh, haven't, haven't sighted the Domita there, uh, but it's six-cylinder petrol auto, as I said. Perfect. Billy, we've got some fantastic auctions. We've got one on today with the classic cars, but we're also doing a classic bike auction. 
mate, we are four o'clock this afternoon. We've got 50 or 60 classic bikes there. There's Katana's, yep. uh, Honda CB 750s. Z1R Mark II, so there's a couple of those. Yeah, yep. SR 500s, yep. mate. There's yep. all the 70 and 80 stuff that we grew up with. All the fantastic bikes, yeah, yeah, of our era, absolutely. Yeah, it is. So, uh, mate, not to take away from this, uh, we got a, uh, I think it's a ZL. ZL, yeah. Fairlane. Yeah, they're great old cars when they came out. The first one with the digital dash, uh, as I remember. Um, so great cars, you know. That's right. I think it's a ZK actually. That one. Not no, that's a, no, that's a ZL. You're dead right, Billy. That's a ZL for sure. ZL yep. for sure. Yep, absolutely. Okay, um, mate. They were. Um they were about fifty thousand dollars from they memory were. when they, they come were. out new. And they were government cars too, so I used to see the uh, premiers and prime ministers and stuff floating around in the back of the LTD version. That's which right. Was just a little bit plusher than the Fairlane, but great cars nonetheless. Yep, eighty-seven. Yeah, it would be. So, mate, um, how about we go back and see how it goes? And don't forget at home, log on to the uh, at four o'clock this afternoon for our classic bike auction. It's going to be a ripper. Here at 570. Now, who else has got a pineapple to throw at it here today, Tobias? Now we're going to bid 570 here at 570. In room bid there at that. At 570 here, we all over and down, and we're done. Finish. We sell them out at 570. Tell me about the line. Thank you, 570. So, well, Bob, Bob, there we go. Thank you, 570 bucks. Good, mate. We'll get your bidder's number in a sec there, but we'll go back over to Ryan with the next one. Made another limo coming through here. 96 Ford Fairlane gear running the V8 engine. I think there are, yeah, five litre V8 injected engine in these. Uh, it's uh, it's a good good old car. A few stone chips on the nose. It's done 300 k's. It should have a few stone chips. But uh, always like the interior in the old Aussie cars. Like have a look at the steering wheel still intact. Plenty of life left in the seats. The dash is pretty good. The back seat looks nice and neat as well. And uh, long wheelbase. So good on country trips. We used to sell a ton of these out west. You'd always see the cowcockers driving in the Fairlanes or Statesmans. And uh, this one is in pretty good order. Back to you guys. Thank you, Ryan. Being offered completely unreserved today, we've got an online bet of $1,000. I That's like great. it. Let's kick it off today. Who's got 100 to play this one here today, buyers? Now we've got 1,000 to go. At 1,000 now, and now we go on this one here. You bid your buy on this one here now, buyers. Now we've got 1,000 to go. At 1,000 here. At 1,000 have been our 1,000 have been here. We've got a bit of 1,000. It wants to be 1,100 bucks. At 1,000 now. 1,000 have been buyers. Now we've got a bit of $1,000. No bucket around. We sell them out today. At 1,000 here. 1,000 have been here. 1,000 have been last call on the floor. $1,000. Now we go. We're done. Finish the 1,000 bucks. Tell me, man. Thank you. Sold online better. 1,015 online buyer. Thank you. Roll them through. And back to. Lee. All right, thank you, Kevy. Joshua Riley, watching the live stream. Your name has been called hey, for the online raffle, mate. So come forward and give us your. Uh, you've got to respond to us in the next two cars, and we'll send you some. Uh, we'll send you your prize. Uh, and also, also, it's mm. important to mention that it's time to draw the in-house raffle tickets. So have your raffles ready. We've just thrown another bunch of tickets in there from the staff. So don't miss out. Gonna win today. This is the winner. Thank you, Kevin. I've got purple ticket A95. That's Chris. We've got thousands of dollars left to give away. And online Joshua Riley from Brunswick, Victoria. So come back to us, Joshua. Joshua and uh, Chris, if you can come forward and see the team, we'll draw your prize shortly. Let's go back to auction. Okay, the next one coming through is a 1997 Concord Fairlane. These are a limited edition, uh, they run slightly different colour scheme to a lot of them, different wheels, bit of chrome work, extra chrome work on them. Uh, this is a six cylinder ejected car and uh, again, these old Fairlanes, they stand up pretty well to uh, age and a bit of wear and tear. This one's done just under 200 k's but it's a good looking old car and they, as we just saw, they, they don't make a lot of money but they're uh, something you can uh, take home and, and drive. Look at this wood grain steering wheel, wood grain leather steering wheel. Uh, just needs a good scrub and a tub, this car, but it's all there. Factory alloy still on it. Uh, even got the Concorde pinstripes on the back quarter panel there. And a good car, mate. Back to you, Lee. Yeah, thanks, Ryan. And uh, we've had uh, some great activity online watching the bidding go up. We've got an online bid of $1,150. Right Let's go to auction. Let's sell it out here today, Unreserved. boys. A lot in reserve, and out we go on the fair line here, guys. Now, 1150 bucks. Who wants a piece of it? I'll take 100 to go. 1150 here. What a quality car there, boys. Now we're going to be 1150 to go. You big 1250 in the box seat. 1150 here. 1150 opening bid there gotta online go. there, boys. Now we're going to be 1150 in the hammers up. And out we go. You bet you buy here today on this one here. Now we're going to. Who wants to be? 1200 bucks. At 1150 here. At 1150 they've been there, boys. Now 1150. No mucking around. We sell them out. 1150 here. At 1150 they've been there. Last call on the floor. 1150 here. Last chance. I'll take 100. Are we done? Finish 1150. Time him out. 
Sold on line number 50. Well Sold. Done. Thank you. And we're back over to Ryan. And Mate, someone's one. obviously decided to sell up their fair lane collection. This is the <laughs> third one coming through. I just had someone say to me, how come you, you've got cars like this coming through? Because we've had that many people email us and say they want something a bit cheaper they can buy and, and dealt with their son or their brother. And we've had a few... Uh, uh, um, what are they, those men's shed clubs looking for cars to, to do and uh, to, to buy and do up and this is probably going to suit someone. This is a 97 V8. It's done 190 Ks and uh, again, good original car. They, uh, they haven't been flogged, these things, like the interior on this car, again, is in good nick. Have a look at it. Very, very tidy car, running sheepskin seat covers, which were the, the flavour of the month back in the 90s. Everyone had to have sheepskin seat covers in their cars. And... Uh, a good old car, aftermarket wheels, but a V8 Fairlane, nice tidy paintwork. Take it home, give it a polish, put some reg on it and take it for a cruise on the weekends. That's Back the idea, you. Ryan. We've got an online bid of $2,700. Over to you, Kev. Rightio. 2700 opening bid. Who's got 200 playing on this one here today? At 27 the bid. At 27 the bid. And by now, we've got a bid 27 here. At 2700 bucks. It's a V8. Have a look at it there. We've got a bid 27 here. On the net. At 27 here. Looking for another two to play. At 27 here. At 27 the bid. We've got a bid 27 there. By now, we've got a bid 27 here. At 27 the bid. At 27 the bid. We've got 2700 bucks and cheap. At 27 now. At 27 the bid. It must be nine. Anyone on the floor? At 27 here. At 27 the mid at 27 the minute 27 the minute 27 the bit last call all over and done 2700 bucks and finished time at the floor thank you 2700 roll them on through there boys thank you 27 we're back over to ryan have we got another fair lane no mate we're uh, we're all out of fair lanes at this stage but we did find an xf falcon out there and this is a little bit different than your standard xf have a look at the paintwork that's going on in this vehicle it looks like a car that's been tattooed doesn't it like the the artwork that's gone into that Plus, it's also running a fuel-injected 302 engine, so it's a little bit different than your standard XF. Set of, uh, they look like Boyd Coddington wheels or something like that, but uh, look, it's all there. Uh, something very, very different. If you want to buy a show car or something to take to an all-four day, it's definitely worth uh, having a look at this one. Back to you guys. Thank you, Ryan. We've got an online bid of $4,000, and we're on the market. It's going to go. Righto. Who wants 200 today? 4,000 to go. I'll take 200 if anyone wants it here. At 4,000 now. 4,000 over any bit online there, boys. Now we're going to bid 4,000. I'll give it two to play. At 4,000 now. At 4 the bid now. We're going to bid 4. We're going to bid $4,000 here. We sell them out today. At 4,000 now. At 4 the bid now. 4 the bid now. 4 the bid now. We're going to bid 4,000. No market around. We sell them out. At $4,000. Last chance. $4,000. We all over and done. Finished on the floor. 4,000. Time him out. Sell online. Thank you. 4,000 and well bought. Back over to you, Lee, with another prize, mate. Yes, Sell thank you. Out. Now, Ryan, I have uh, Joshua from Victoria wants to draw number 36. Number 30. Oh, here it is. That's an easy one for me to find. It's down the bottom here. Oh, Josh. Lucky you. It's chook time. Uh, do we mail the chooks or we get them to fly down? Uh, we'll send that express post. Express post. Express Beautiful. post. Beautiful. Okay. And for our in-house raffle oh, winner. Sorry, how are you going? Good, thanks. Now, what draw number would you like? I'd like to go number nine, please. Number nine. That'll be down this way somewhere if you'd like to follow me. And hopefully there's a... Uh, let's have a look. There we go. Lucky envelope. If you'd like to open the envelope. Here we go. And it is... It is a... Oh, wow. A $50 voucher for any of Australia's favourite restaurants. There you go. Take a break. Have a good night. Okay. Oh, we found another fair lane. Look at this. <laughs> found another fair lane. Just when you thought there was no more left. This is a very early one, actually. Uh, this would be a Z... K. Ooh, ZK K. or a K. Yeah, J's were the first of this shape. K's were different, slightly different grill on them. Um, hermitage in colour. Now, you would probably spend a bit of money on paint. It's got a little bit of rust around the back window on the boot lid and stuff. Again, the trim stands out pretty well on this car. No cracks in the dash. And the G was, I tell you what, I remember being a kid, and it's got the factory broken door handle, which all the Fords did back in the day. But look at that. Look at the blue trim on that. Power windows. These were flash when they came out. I was only a young nick, nipper when these came out. and Beautiful cars. Anyway, let's see it go to a good home. I'll pass it back to you, Lee. All right. Thank you, Ryan. Kevy, we've got an online bid of $2,000.
Let's go to auction. Righto. Let's have a look here today, Myers. Now we've got 2,000 to kick it away. 2,000 opening bid there, Myers. Who's got 100 to play? At 2,000 here, we sell them out here today. At 2,000 now. At 2,000 now, we're going to be 2, we're going to be 2, we're going to be 2,000. We sell them out at $2,000. At 2,000 now. At 2, they're now, we're going to be 2, we're going to be 2. He's got another 100 to play. At 2 now, 2 now, we are at $2,000. At 2,000 now. At 2, they're now, we're going to be 2,000. We sell them out $2,000. All over and done, 2,000. Time at the floor, thank you. Sold online, Sold. Board, 2,000. Back over to you, Ryan. Surely not another fair lane. Mate, no, this one, uh, I think when this one was produced, there weren't even fair lanes in, in Australia. They're probably in the States, but not in Australia. 64, I think this one is. 64 Falcon. And, uh, and what a nice old car. White with the red flash up the side. I used to love, I love the way back in the day they'd put this, uh, the chrome moles with the red flash or blue flash up the sides of these. Red interior. Uh, and it's a Futura. And what a classic old car. Have a look at it. It is a very, very good car. Now, this has been a daily driver for someone, so it hasn't been stuck in a shed. The car does run and drive very, very well. Got a few little blisters in the paint, but it's all there. The beautiful old Ford badge on the boot lid. But uh, classic car. Needs to go to a good home. I'll pass it back to you, Lee. Thanks, Ryan. It is a beautiful design. One we see very rarely here at Lloyd's Classic Cars. Got an online bid of $10,000. Let's go to auction, Kev. It's a beautiful looking car. Have a look at it there. 10,000 and kick him away. He's got five to play. At 10,000, opening bid online there, buyers. Now we're going to bid 10, looking for a half. At 10,000 now. At 10, the bid now we're going to bid 10. We're going to bid $10,000 now. He's got five to throw it at here. At 10 now. At 10, the bid now we're going to bid 10. We're going to bid 10. Opening bid $10,000. At 10, the bid is online. At 10,000 now. And cheap at that. At 10, the bid now we're going to bid $10,000. He's got five. Come on now, we're going to bid 10. At 10 here. At 10, we're going to bid 10. We're going to bid $10,000. At 10 now. At 10, the bid now 10. Now it's just on the floor. At 10, $10,000 will time him out all finished. 10000 and done. Time him out, thank you. Prefer to roll him through there, boys. 10000 Now back over to Lee with another draw. All right. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, if you have just joined us, we've got a uh, raffle going on online and here in house. So if you don't have a raffle ticket, have a, have a look for some uh, Lloyd staff who are still giving out some tickets to put you in the competition. Um, we have what we'll do now is call the in house raffle prize. And if your number is called, we'll invite you to come up and join the staff. It'll be green ticket F49, that's Jeff. So F49, Jeff, if you'd like to come forward and hang out with the team, and uh, we'll call the prize shortly. Let's right go on. to auction. Very good. Well done. All righty. Yeah, that's fine. Thanks, boys. Lot 55. An unbelievable barn thrind, unfortunately not coming through, but it's the 1938 Ford Standard Roadster. Uh, it is the V8 petrol, three-speed manual, finished in white. Um, this vehicle is as original as it gets. Um, it's Australian built, and it's only believed to be one of five built at Ford in Geelong, down in Victoria. So unlike the American models, this is a genuine four-seater, there's no dicky seat, and it's an unbelievable barn find. You, it will be very hard to find another one of these in Australia. Um, looks like it's going quite, quite cheap at the moment, so somebody who snaps it up will get it for a good price and hopefully hold Billy, on. We've got this fantastic old Ford Standard Roadster here, mate. I believe this is one that was possibly made by Ford in Geelong back in 1938. This could be one of the very first uh, Fords that they produced in this country, I'm not sure. That's, uh, that's in the blurb, but a fantastic looking thing and a great restoration project. Oh, it is. Uh, mate, that'll be a very special car when mm. it's finished, won't it? Mm. I can just picture it. Absolutely. Flathead V8, I believe. Uh, you know, what more could you ask for? This is the real styling from the 1930s. This is what everyone wanted back in the day the, uh, with the Roadster two-door. Absolutely. Mm. Uh, mate, um, you know, to find a car in really in that condition to start with, yep. uh, mate, it's, it's got everything there that you need. Uh, yep. Mate, uh, I think this car will go, uh, go crazy. Absolutely. How about we get back to the blocks and see what it makes? Another one, 8,100 here, at 8, one the bid, 8,100 bucks a bid now buyers, now we're going to bid 8, one, are we all over and done, at 8,001, 4, online, 8,400 bucks, online buyer there buyers, now we're going to bid 8, four, seven. straight back, I like it, at 8,700 here, look at the, look at the 9 next, at 8, seven the bid, at 8, seven the bid there buyers, now we're going to bid 8,700 here, at 8, seven the bid, look at the 9 anywhere to go, now we're going to bid 8,700 here, we all over and done, at 8,700 here, look at the 3's next, at 8, seven here, 8, seven the bid, we all finish at 8,700 and done.
Finished on the floor. Time him out, eight, seven, nine. nine. Back on nine. We're still going. Nine's At 9,000 here. At nine, the people are going to be nine. We're going to be nine. We're going to be $9,000. At 9,000 now. At nine, the people are going to be 9,000. Again, another three if you want to be in. At 9,000 now. Nine, the people are going to be $9,000 near the road. So there, we're going to be 9,000 online. At nine, the bid. At nine, the bid. Will he go another one? At nine, the bid. Now we're going to be nine. We're going to be $9,000. We all over and done. Finished. It's out of time. Time out. Thank you, 9,000. Refer to the online buyer there. Thank you at $9,000. And back over to you, Ryan. We've got something special. Mate, very special. Ford Speedster. This thing looks like it was built in 1935, but it was actually built in 2009. Um, running a six-cylinder Ford engine in it. Automatic transmission. And it, yeah, the guy's done a great job on this. It really, really has. And he's, I like the way he's, he's stuck to the old school sort of uh, look with the car. Um, like the mesh grille. It's just done it right. The front end's done perfectly. Um, but you've got the reliability of a late model engine and gearbox. Uh, can be registered in Queensland. It is fully complied, so there's no problems there about registering the car. Um, and uh, just perfect. Disc brake front end. This would be a cool cruising car. So um, I'll pass it back to you guys. Thank you. Thank you, Ryan. And we've got an online bid of $18,700. Righto. Who wants to own this one at here today? Buyers now. We'll get a bit 8.7 to go. 8.7 the bid. 18.7 the buyers now. We'll get a bit 18,700. Looking for a five next. 18.7 the opening bid. 18,700 here, buyers now. Come on, who's got a half to play? At 18.7 the bid. 18,700 online. At 18.7 the bid now, buyers now. We'll get a bit 18.7. Come on. At 18.7 here. 18.7 the bid now. Worth every dollar. 18.7 now. At 18.7 the bid. Where do you find another one? Have you seen another one? 18,700 on the net. 18.7 the bid. At 18.7 the bid of buyers now. We'll get a bit 18,700. At 18.7 now. 18.7 the bid in buyers here. We're going to bid 18.7. At 18.7 now. 18.7, come on. At 18.7 there. Have a look at it. $18,700. 18.7 the bid. Sounds cheap to me. 18.7 now. 18.7 the bid now. 18.7 the bid in buyers there. We're going to bid 18,007. Who wants to ram it in 19? Come on. At 18.7 here. 18.7 the bid now. 18.7 the bid now. $18,700. At 18.7 now. We all over and done. 18,700 on the floor now. Anyone else want to go? 18,700. We're done. Time out the floor, thank you. Time out the line there, thank you. Rolling that one through there, boys. 18-7. And back over to Ryan. Mate, uh, this car has had a lot of inquiries this week. Uh, it's a XW Fairmont sedan. It's running a very, very warm 351 V8 on it. Uh, and a good car. Like, it's had, it's had a repaint at one stage, but most of the trim's original. I'll just give you a look underneath the bonnet of this car because it, it presents very well. The motor's just been rebuilt, running a shaker on top. And uh, the guy's done a great job. Very nice set of extractors on the car. Everything's been done very, very nicely. Uh, 12 slot wheels with trims and caps, but the interior is nice in the car as well. It's just a very, very nice car. I'd, uh, I'd gladly take this thing home and put it in my garage. The trim's nice. I'll just quickly open the door here. Like the door trim, they're not a replacement, they're factory door trims, still the Fairmont trims and dash. The seats, very nice car. So I'd uh, like to see it go to a good home. I'll pass it back to you guys. Thanks, buddy. Yeah, thank you, Ryan. We've got a, an online bid of $36,500, and we're completely unreserved, Kev. This car will go to a good home today. Very, very good. I like it. All right, 36,500 the bin. I'll take a thousand to go. Seven five up the back. Thank you, sir. At 37.5. 37.5 and in front. Who's got another grand to play? At 37.5. 37.5. We sell them out today. At 37,500 he buys. Now we're going to be 37.5. At 37.5 now. 37,500 the bin is in front. And thank you there, sir. Now we're going to be 37.5. 37.5 the bin. At 37.5 the bin. Anyone else on the floor? Come on, another grand. You never know. At 37.5. 37.5 the bin. We're going to be 37,000. At 37 and a half. At 37 and a half. At 37 and a half. We're going to be 385 online. 385. A grand. 39.5. 39.5. Straight back. 39.5. The bid. At 39.5. The bid. Buyers there. We're going to be 39.5. And back in front, sir. At 39.5. At to my left, the buyers there. We're going to be 39,500 here. And we sell them out today. At 39.5. At 39.5. The bid. We're going to be 39 and a half. At 39 and a half. There. A lot of car. At 39,500 here. At 39.5. The bid. 39,500. The bid. We're going to be 39 and a half. At 39.5 here. 39.5 the minute. We're going to be 39.5. And you're in front. At 39.5. At 39.5 the minute. At 39.5. We're going to 39,500 here. At 39.5. Are we all over and down online? At 39.5. At 39.5 the minute. Last chance. Anyone else on the floor? At 39,500. Are we all done? Sell them out here. 39.5. Time me out online. Thank you. 39.5. Sold to you there, sir. Well bought. Thank you. 2-3. Sorry, mate. 2-3-6-9-5-2. Well bought. Thank you very much. I think that's me. Back to you, Lee. Thank you.
All right, try, time to draw another prize, Ryan. I've got a raffle draw for Paul from Tasmania. So thank you for your support, Paul, all the way from Tasmania. Ryan, Paul would like draw number three if it's still available. Number three. Let's have a look. Number one, two, three. Tasmania, great spot. Been there a few times. There'd be some good cars in Tassie. There's some great cars in Tasmania. I was in a little town. I saw two Phase 3 Falcons in the same town, one after the other. Couldn't believe it. Now, let's see if I can do this. So I'm a bit... Uh... Here we go. Here we go. $100. Well, well done. done. $100. We'll He's uh, got a post. price here. Very, very, very good. Back to you guys. Thank you very much. Thanks, Ryan. Thanks, Ryan. Congratulations to the online viewer there. Lot 58. Not coming through for obvious reasons. It's the longest fair lane in Australia. Uh, it's very unique. Uh, try to find another one and you can't. It's got a rear mounted engine, uh, custom built. It's based on a Ford LTD, um, air conditioned, uh, obviously used for commercial purposes as a stretch limo. Um, only indicating 120,000 kilometres um, and it is the 12 seater. So if you're thinking to start your own. You've got something pretty special coming up right now, mate the uh, stretch limousine. It looks like, it looks like fantastic, doesn't it? Mate, it does. It's actually uh, a six by two. If you note the uh, dual wheels at the back, I see but, that. But mate, it's more special. The engine's remounted in it. It's running a three and a half litre V6. Are you serious? Absolutely. Uh, and because it's a it's a thirteen seater um, limousine, yeah. the floor's flat in it, so it doesn't run a tail shaft. That's why they put the engine in the back, I guess. Absolutely. So, mate, uh, this is fully engineered. Uh, it's been in, it's been a private vehicle hire car on the Gold Coast. Um, it's got uh, the certificates and mm. all the stuff yep. with it. Yep. So uh, all the paperwork. Yep. Yeah. So, uh, mate, this is a great fun car for someone. It looks fantastic, doesn't it? Very unique. Well, mate, if you've got a big family or a lot of friends, um, <laughs> absolutely. You know, imagine rolling up to the beach in this. Absolutely, it'd be fantastic, wouldn't it? Yep, mate. How about we go back to the blocks and see what it makes? Ten thousand dollars. Have a look at their buys now. We're going to be ten thousand here. At ten, the bid. At ten, the bid of buys now. We're going to be ten. We're going to be ten. We're going to be ten thousand. Last chance. Ten thousand dollars. And out we go. At ten, the bid. And all over and done. Ten thousand dollars on the limit. Their buys. Close them off. Refer them online buys there. Thank you. Ten thousand. And back over to you, Ryan. Yeah, mate, this, uh, this is a gorgeous car. This is an XT Falcon. It looks like a GT, but it's not. But it's running a very, very healthy 351 on it. And it's Zircon Green, which is probably one of my favourite colours in these cars. He's done a, a good job on this car. It's, it's a column automatic, but what I like, he's left the, buck, uh, the bench seats in it, sorry. So it's running bench seat, column automatic. Got an early style uh, custom steering wheel on it. Looks like an old Mustang steering wheel. All of that. Have a look at that. Beautiful. And underneath the bonnet... If I can give you a quick look, because he's done a great job under here. Have a look at this. Beautiful. Very, very healthy 351 in this car. And uh, not overdone. Not covered in chrome work or anything like that. Just presented very, very nicely. And uh, a credit to the owner. There's the compliance plate. The early Fords had the compliance plate on the radar support panel. This one's still carrying the original plate on it. But just a lovely car. Good cruising car. Sits right, looks right, and sounds very, very nice. And... Uh, It'd be a lot cheaper than a GT, but you should have some fun in it. Back to you guys. Thank you. Thank you, Ryan. Heaps of interest on this car this week. We've got an online bid of $33,500. What's it worth? Find out. Here we go. 33 and a half. Have a crack at this one here today, boys. I'll take a thousand from here. 33.5. Opening bid online there, boys. Now we're going to bid 33,500 now. At 33 and a half. At 33 and a half there, boys. Now we're going to bid 34.5. Online. 34.5. 34.5. bid online there, boys. Now we're going to bid 34.5. On the phone. 35.5. 35.5. The bid is on the phone there, boys. Now we're going to bid 35,500 now. And in front. On the phone. The phone bid there, boys. Now we're going to bid 35.5. 35 and a half. At 35 and a half. Look at another grand to go. Anyone want to go now? We're going to bid 35. 35.5, 5, and in front on the phone at 35.5. A lot of car, it's gorgeous. Have a look at it there at 35.5. 35, 35.5, 5, the bit of buyers now. We're going to bid 35.5. Look at another grand. Come on, who's got it? At 35.5. At 35,000, the bit now. We're going to bid 35.5. At 35.5, and go. At 35.5, come on, another grand. You never know. At 35.5. At 35,000, a lot of car for that. At 35.5. At 35,000, the bit now. We're going to bid 30,500 here. At 35.5. At 35.5, the bit now. All done. Finish at 35. Five, five, all over and done. Thirty-five, five. five. We'll time out the floor. Thank you. Time out on line thirty-five, five. Done. Prefer that fine bit of there. Yeah, Thank you. Rolling yeah. through there, boys. And we're back over to Lee again with another raffle draw. All right, Kevy. Time to draw a raffle for the in our in-house uh, supporters. I'll get you to do the honours. Very good. 
Good luck, everybody. Have your raffle tickets ready. We have Dion. Who? Dion. Green ticket, F42. Dion. Dion, I'll invite you to come forward and um, meet with the team and we'll draw your prize shortly. Still hundreds of dollars to go. Thank you, everybody, for your support. And um, we'll go to... Oh, I've just had the online raffle winner come forward too. It's Jason Kinsella from New South Wales. So, Jason, if you're out there, thank you very much for your support. And come back to us in the next two cars with a draw number. Uh, the big one could be yours. Jason, well done. Thank you for your support. And let's go back to the auction. Mate, uh, this is a, a good car. This is a uh, XB GT Falcon. Matching numbers. You don't see too many in white. You see a lot of them in yellow or red or green. This one's white, and it's a very, very good car. Uh, it's still running the original engine and box in it. I love the wheels on it. I think they, was not fa they looked as similar to the factory uh, rally sport wheels, but I don't think they are. But what a great old car. Have a look at it. Original doors trim still. This is what I love about some of these cars. They haven't had the remanufactured ones. Still running all the original stuff. Uh, steering wheel still in good nick. The console, just a beautiful old car. And what a great colour combo, white with black. Have a look at the back seats, and look at that. Beautiful, that's still the original vinyl in that car. Just a gorgeous car. Rear Venetian, and just a classic car. These things are very, very underrated. They've only just started really kicking on the XBs. And this is probably one of the rarest colour combos you can get. And uh, a good car, just a couple little blemishes on the bonnet, but the rest of the car presents very, very well. It'd be a great one to take home and put in the shed. Pass it back to you, Lee. Thank you, Ryan. And isn't it spectacular in the white? Mm. We are offering this car today completely unreserved. We've got an online bid of $56,500, and it will sell today. Let's go, Kevy. How Absolutely. much? Absolutely. Who wants to be the new owner of this one here? At 56.5. Open him in there, buyers. Now take two grand to go. At 56.5. 56 and a half there, buyers. Now come on, you got to be two grand. You want to be in the box seat here today? Go. And we sell them out of here. At 56.5. 56.5. We're going to be 56,500 here. At 56.5. The GT there. Have a look at it there, buyers. Now we're going to be 56,500 here. Who's got two grand to play? At 56.5. 56,500 here. We're going to sell them out of here today. At 56.5. New owner today, you buyers. Now we're going to be 56,500 on the net. At 56 and a half. 56 and a half now we all over now we sell them out 56,500 we finished down on the floor time him out sold online thank you 56.5 online buyer brother went through there boys and back over to you Ryan oh, well good board. buying mate that's a great card have, have, a, have a look at this next one coming through F track red XY GT Falcon tribute not a real one but gee whiz I tell you what it's very very close it, the guy has spent a mozza on this and done it correctly the paint's great Five slot wheels, wide and five slot wheels with trims and caps. Black interior, and the interior looks great in it. Proper GT dash, good door trims, console, steering wheel. Hello. Hello. Just really looks the part. And the gentleman that owns this car, he's got quite a few Fords in his collection, and he's very, very fussy with all his stuff. And make sure everything's correct on the car. It's running a very healthy 351. Manual gearbox, nine inch rear end, all the right all the right uh, moulds and the, G the GT badging on it, and just a great car. They look good in red. Rear Venetian looks tremendous in the car, and uh, it's going to be a lot cheaper than a genuine XY GT, but you can have just as much fun in this one at probably half the price. Back to you guys. Thank you, Ryan. It's a stunner in red. We've got an online bid of $85,000. What's it worth? Let's kick it off here. 85,000 to go there, boys. I'll take two grand to go on this one here today. 85,000 now. 85, they've been out the XY there, boys. Now we've got a bit 85 here. 85, the bid is on the net. Who's got two grand to play? Come on. 85,000 now. It's gorgeous. 85, the bid. 85, they've been out racing around the boys. Now we've got a bit 85 here. 85 now. 85, they've been online the boys. Now we've got a bit 85 now. 85, the bid. 85, the bid was to be seven. Come on. At 85 now. 85, the bid the boys. Now come on. We've got a bit 85. Thousand dollars now. It's better than that. Come on. At 85 now, 85 the bid, 85 the bid, who's got two grand, come on, I know you want it, 85,000, it's my favourite car in the auction, 85,000, at 85 the bid, 85 the bid buyers now, we're going to bid 85,000 now, at 85 here, 85 the bid is on the net, surely can I tempt you, 85,000 here, at 85 the bid, 85 the bid the buyers now, we're going to bid 85 car. here, 85 now, 85 the bid now, we've got the phone bit there on the phone there buyers now, we're going to bid 85, 85 now, 85 and go, at 85 the bid, come on, two big gorillas, come on you man, I did it. 
today at 85 now. 85 thousand dollars here at 85 now. 85 the mini buyers now. We're gonna bid 85 thousand dollars. Are we done? At 80 thousand five. 85 thousand dollars here at 85 here at 85. The these were popular with Moffat, weren't they, Ron? 85,000. Moffat raced this, didn't he? He certainly did, mate. Moffat, Gagan, a lot of guys raced XYs back in the day. Probably, the mo well, they are the most popular Falcon model ever. Uh, and the guys even got the right mirrors on this car. Like, you, you could not build this car for that sort of money. Not the quality build it and the paintwork and the bodywork and the trim and the engine. Like, you, you dead set could not build it for what this guy spent on it. And uh, as I said, you've just got to look at the interior and stuff. He's done it right. The carpets, the door trims, the dash. Everything's right. The wheels, it is a credit to him. The paint is perfect. And probably, the, besides the Vermilion Fire, this uh, track red with the gold stripes probably is the second most popular colour in them. And a great car. And we, we've sold a few uh, tribute cars in the past. And I dare to say this is probably the best we've had. So someone out there, if they want one, if it, that was a genuine XY GT sitting there now, it'll be 220, 250K. So, you know, it's a lot cheaper and it's good buying. So let's, let's see if we can get off to a good home. Thanks, guys. Well, no, thank you, Ryan. Well said. 85,000 is where we're at. 85,000. The bid online there, buyers. Now we're going to bid 85 and go. 85 the bid. $85,000 here now, buyers. Now we're going to bid 85. $85,000 now. At 85 the bid. 85 the bid now, buyers. Now we're going to bid 85. They're having a conference on the phone. 85,000. They were seeking some instructions there from the vendor, the buyers. Now we're going to bid 85 here. 85 now. At 85 the bid. Who's going to jump in? 85 now. At 85 the bid. We're going to bid 85,000 now. At 85 now. Come on, I can't wait all day. 85,000 at 85 the bid at 85 the bid we're going to bid $85,000 here and it's a gorgeous car $85,000 now what am I doing 85 now 85 the bid we're going to bid $85,000 here buyers now we're going to bid $85,000 at 85 now 85 the bid buyers now we're going to bid 85 online 85 are on the net 85 now 85 the bid we're going to bid 85 85 now 85 now come on Nathan I need an answer 85,000 85 I'm going to time him out 85,000 now. At 85, they've been out. 85, they've been out. Last caller. We'll time him out. 85,000. Done. Time him out. Thank you. Roll him through there, boys. 85,000. Over to you, Ryan. With the next slide. Thank you. Thanks, guys. XB GT Coupe. Now, this car has been two thirds of the way through a restoration. We're not sure the story behind it, but the car isn't finished. Most of the parts are in the boot. It is a matching numbers. 3514 speed XB GT Coupe. Finished in yellow, well, I'll get this wrong for sure, yellow blaze, I think, but I'll be corrected, no doubt, if I'm wrong. But 15-inch uh, Bathurst globes. The paint's very, very good on the car. It's got the correct engine in it. It does need putting back together, but as I said, most of the parts are in the boot on this car, so coupes are going crazy, and uh, this thing looks like it's straight out of a Ford sales brochure. The colour's fantastic, the paint works great, and all it needs is someone to take it home, put it in the garage, finish it off, and what a great investment and a great weekend cruise car. Back to you, Ben. Thanks, Ryan. Great little project. We've got an online bid of $74,000. Let's go to auction. Let's, Let's have a bit of fun here. What an absolutely gorgeous car there. 74, opening bid. Kick him off there, ladies and gentlemen. I'll take two grand to go. 84, sorry, $74,000 here. At 74 now. At 74, the bid buyers now. We're going to bid $74,000 here. At 74 now. 74, the bid. At 74, the bid. Who wants to it today? I'll take two grand to go. At 76, online. $76,000 now. Eight, 78. Online buyers now. We're going to bid 78000 At 78 now. At 78, the bid buyers now. We're going to bid 78. Looking for 80 next. 78 now. At 78, the bid. At 78000 here at 78 the bid. The XB there buys now. We're going to bid 80. $80,000. At 80,000 is where we're at. At 80,000 now. 80,000. Look for another two to play there buys now. We're going to bid 80,000. At 80 here. 80 the bid there buys now. We're going to bid 82. 82. And we're selling. 82 and out we go. At 82 now. You bid you buy here. Now we're going to bid 84. 84 online. They want it. $84,000. At 84 the bid. Anyone else want to join in? We've got 84,000 online. At 84 the bid. And hammers up and out we go. $84,000. We sell. This one today. 84 here. Selling. At 84 the bid. At 84 the bid. At 84 the bid. At 84 the bid. Now we're going to bid 86. They're back. 86,000. 86,000. The two horse race online. 86 now. We'll leave you eight. 86 and we sell them. Eight straight back. At 88 now. At 88 the bid. Now we're going to bid 8,000. $8, 88, we're at 90, we're at at 90 now. At 90, the minute buyers now, we're going to be 90. All the action online at $90,000. At 90,000 now, two. two. 92, 92 bid now. At 92, the minute buyers now, we're going to be $92,000. Here we go. At 92 now, four. four. 94, 94, online. all the action online. Two horse race here today, buyers now, we're going to be 94, six. 
96. Will we get there? 96. We sell them out. At 96 here. 96. Now we're going to be 96. 96,000. I'm getting excited. Here we go. We're going to sell out today. 96,000 here. At 96 to bid. 96,000. Lots of buyers now. We're going to be 96. At 96 here. Anyone else want to join in? 96,000 dollars. You're going to miss out. 96 here. At 96 to bid. Has he got two more? 96 here. 96. You're going to miss out. We're selling. 96,000 dollars. At 96 to bid. At 96 to bid. Are we all over and done? 96,000. We're having a conference. We've got a phone bidder. 96. 96. Geez, you're a good dancer, Nathan. 96,000. At 96 here. 96. The bid there, buyers. Now we're going to bid 96. At 96. 8. 98. Think about it. $98,000. At 98, the bid. 98, the bid. Who wants to be 100,000? 98 now. At 98, the buyers now. We've got 100. 100,000 dollars. At 100 here. 100, the bid. 102. 102 now. At 102, the bid. 102,000. Still chasing twos if anyone wants to join in. At 102. 102, the bid. At 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 102 now. 102. You got something to say, right? You're smiling at me. Well, I'm just laughing at you going there. No, this is a great card. That's still not a lot of money. I reckon the car's worth more money than that. Because all it's going to take is someone to spend a week or two putting this car back together and finishing it off, and the thing's probably going to be worth 150, 160. So, it's good buying, and uh, mate, hopefully it's going to go to a great home today. And I'll let you get back to it. Kevin, you've had friends. a breath now. Absolutely, had a sip of water. Here we go, and <laughs> we're man. back, and we're at 104. 104 is where we're at here, boys. Now online, the two horse race, they battle it out there online. Six, online. he's back. 106. 106,000 at 106 for? now at 106 and it is an absolutely gorgeous car 106 106,000 here at 106 the bid 106 the bid it's a great investment 106 go. here and we sell them out here today buyers now we got a bid 106 are you sure you're eight done online? online 8 108 108 now at 108 the bid 108,000 now at 108 the bid Kenny round bidders. number 10 at 1,008 108 thousand dollars here at 108 the bid 108 thousand here come on at 108 the bid can we get 110 at 108 at 108 now i'm asking for two more if you're there online if you can hear me i'm at 108 at 108 the bid you're gonna miss out last call we sell them out at 108 thousand dollars here at 108 the bid at 108 the bid now 108 the bid now 108 the bid last call 108 thousand are we finished we're done first call on the floor 108 thousand ten. Ten. One ten. One ten. One hundred and ten is where we're at. At one ten. One hundred and ten we're out there, buyers now. We're gonna be one ten. At one ten now. Looking for another two who's gonna oh, be a twelve. He's straight back. He wants it. He wants it bad. We're at one twelve. One hundred and twelve thousand. At one hundred and twelve we're at. At one twelve the bid. All the action online. At one twelve the bid buyers now. We're gonna be one twelve. At one twelve now. One hundred and twelve thousand. On the XP curve they have a look at their buyers now. We're gonna be one twelve. At one twelve now. It's a lot of money, I'll get you to have a think about it, but we're at one twelve. We sell them out. At one twelve now. At one twelve the bid the buyers now. We're gonna be one twelve. One hundred and twelve thousand. Are we done? We sell them out. At one twelve now. At one twelve now. First call on the floor. At one hundred and twelve thousand. Are we done? Second call, 112,000. Third and final. Last call, we sell them out. 112, we're done. Finished. Time the floor out. Sold. 112. Well bought online. Thank you. And over to you, Ryan. Thank you with the next one. Mate, well done. That was a great effort, Kev. You never came up for a breath. Someone's got a good car at a great buy there. Absolutely. Have a look at this thing. This is a 1970 Ford Torino GT. It's a factory 429 Super Cobra Jet drag pack. This car is very, very rare. They only made a couple of hundred in this, in this setup. It's had three owners its whole life and it's done a genuine 64,000 miles. So the paint's 90% original, original matching numbers car. The gentleman who owns his cars, he's been, had the car for many years and he's got a dossier. It's like reading the Encyclopedia Britannica. He's got that much paperwork on it. Has got a Marty report with it. It's all matching numbers. The paint's correct. All the codes are correct on this car. And it is an absolute stunner. You just got to have a look at it. Like all, have a look at the interior. You just got to love the American styles. Like the big dash, beautiful big dash, column automatic, plenty of room in the back of these things, but it's a fa factory drag pack and very, very rare. And this car, I wouldn't be surprised if we went back to America. In the States, this car would be worth an absolute mozza. But if someone in Australia is looking for a good investment and loves American muscle cars, it's well worth having a look at this car. Beautiful, beautiful condition. All the right provenance with this car. All the right paperwork with it. 
and just very, very rare. A lot rarer than a GD Falcon or anything like that. These cars are super rare, and even in the States, they're worth big money. So I'll pass it back to you guys, and let's see where it ends up. Thank you. Thanks very much, Ryan. That's a great summary of a great car. We've got an online bid of 65500 What's it worth? All righty. 65.5 to kick the Torino off today. Here, buyers. Now we've got a bit 60, 65.5. 65.5 now. Take another grand to go. They've another two grand to go. They've now. We've got a bit 65.5. 65.5 and go. At 65.5, the Benair buyers. Now we're going to bid online there. 65.5. At 65.5 here. 65.5, the Benair buyers. Now we've got a bit 65.5. Have a look at it. It's gorgeous. 65.5. At 65.5, the bid. At 65.5, the buyers. Now we've got a bit 65.5. Who's got two to play? At 65.5. 65.5, the Benair line. The buyers. Now we're going to 65 and a half at 65 and a half now and she's better than that come on at 65 five it's a torino 65 five at 65 five it's where we're at at 65 five the bit is on the net there buyers come on don't miss out at 65 five who's got two grand to play on the floor come on where are you at 65 five is where we're at at 65 five the mini buyers there we're gonna be 65 and a half 65 and a half now at 65 and a half the buyers now we're gonna be 65 five we're gonna find better on the country on the phone there back at the back there we're gonna be 65 five 65 five is where we're at at 65 five now 65 and a half there buyers looking for another two grand come on at 65 five 65 five the many buyers now we're gonna be 65 and a half at 65 and a half are we all done at 65 five at 65 five it's had its time we're done 65 five we're finished time I'm out there thank you we're rolling through there 65 five and back over to Ryan thank you with the next one thank you buddy quick quick Okay, the next car is an XW GTHO. Now, uh, this car has been in the same owners for about, I think, 10 or 11 years, and the owner before him had it for about 20 years. So that it's only had a few owners in its life, uh, running a very healthy 341 matching numbers Cleveland engine, uh, four-speed manual top-loader gearbox, and uh, just a very, very good car. It's, it's an older resto. It was, rest, as I said, rest, restored over 10 years ago. And... Uh, what a beautiful car. Just get the young chap inside to pull the bonnet. Good on you, mate. Well done. Have a look at that. Just gorgeous. Beautiful car. Very, very healthy engine in this thing. Uh, it's got all the right uh, stamps on it, all the body numbers. Uh, finished in diamond white, which it, the car just looks stunning. Uh, all the trim's right with the car. It's running the proper nine-inch rear end in it. And uh, just a beautiful, beautiful car. A little bit of paperwork with this car too to... Uh, to prove its provenance, and um, you won't find one much better. I love the uh, the old mesh headlights on these, the headlight protectors on these things too. What a classic looking car! But uh, if you're out there in the market for a good HA, you won't find much better than this. I'll pass it back to you guys. Thank you, Ryan, for the king of the Fords. We've got an online bid of one hundred and fifty thousand dollars. Sounds cheap to me. We'll chase five grand on this one here today, buyers. One hundred and fifty thousand dollars to kick it away. One fifty here. At one fifty the bid now. We're going to bid one hundred and fifty thousand here, buyers. At one fifty now. At one fifty the bid now. Your chance should have gone straight up. At one fifty now. At one fifty the bid buyers now. We're going to bid one hundred and fifty thousand dollars here. At one fifty now. Who's got five to play? One fifty here. One fifty the bid buyers now. We're going to bid one hundred and fifty thousand. At one fifty here. One fifty the bid. Come on, another five. You never know. At one fifty here. One fifty the bid. So, uh, Benny, here we go. We've got the uh, 1970 XW GDHO Falcon. Mate, uh, we've seen these skyrocket in value over the last 12 years, like everything else. Uh, mate, this is a very special car, very well presented. It is. I have not seen an XW GDHO as immaculate as this ever in my life. This is things absolutely amazing. Yeah, it is. Uh, and don't forget, next Saturday, uh, Lloyd's uh, got another auction. Where from? But the home of motor racing in Australia from Bathurst. Exactly right, mate. We'll try and do some laps at Mount Panorama while over there. But they've got the races on, so we, I don't think we can. No, but <laughs> mate, we might be able to sneak out at midnight or something. <laughs> so uh, anyone at home, if you've got any beautiful race cars... Uh, a couple of GT Falcons, a couple of XU1 Taranas, and you'd like to include them in the auction, give our classic car team a call. Uh, but how about, uh, Betty, we go back to the uh, XW GDHO. Beautiful example. Let's, let's, let's go back to the blocks and see how it finishes. 50 now. I need an answer. At 150 now. At 150 the bid the buyers now. We've got 150,000. All time around. At 150 here. At 150 the bid the buyers now. We've got 150. We're all done. 150 here. We finished. Done. Time around. 150. Thank you. Refer that one in online. Thank you. 150. Roll that one through there, boys. We're back over to Lee. Thank you with another prize. 
All right, thank you, Kevy. And it is a good when the energy just lifts with these Fords coming through and the Holdens are coming through shortly as well, so still plenty more history to go under the hammer. Uh, it's time uh, that we announce another raffle winner, so I have Andrew Watts online. Andrew, thank you for your support and uh, watching this, uh, the, the, the live stream. Andrew, you've got a couple of cars to come back to us and give us the draw number. We've still got thousands of dollars in those draws to give away. Uh, so make no mistake, we'll be giving it all away. That's cold hard cash today in the draws. Andrew, congratulations, come back to us and we'll draw the in-house raffle prize winner. Reason, a bit. Over to you, Kev. Alrighty. We have another winner. <laughs> all right, green ticket F47, that's Marek. Green ticket F47. Come forward and see Nathan. We'll draw the uh, prizes shortly. So that's Green Ticket F47 and Andrew Watts in Queensland. Thank you for your support, and uh, let's go back to the auction. OK, guys, the next car coming through. I reckon there wouldn't be too many one-owner XC Falcon Cobras in Australia, and this is what we've got here. One-owner Falcon Cobra. Now, this car uh, has been uh, running the uh, Cannibal Run up North Queensland. Gentlemen's had it, as I said, from brand new. The engine in it, uh, we had it running earlier today and it sounds like it should have been out of one of Dick Johnson's Falcons. It's a very, very healthy motor in it. Uh, sounds extremely tough. It must have five or 600 horsepower, I'd say. It's plenty of grunt in it. And what a car. Like, he's had a lot of fun in this car. As I said, from brand new, there wouldn't be, I think there'd be another one in a copper left in Australia, to be honest. Um, very good car and uh, should go to a great home. Like, you could use this in Target Tasmania or any of that sort of, those sort of events. Or just put it away in the shed and watch it go up in value. But uh, great car, got all the history with it, all the paperwork, and uh, time to move it on to a new home. And hopefully, someone out there is going to take advantage of it. Back to you guys. Thank you, Ryan. And speaking of going up in value, we've got an online bid of $172,000. Let's go to auction, Kevy. Righto, on the very special car here today, ladies and gentlemen, 172 to kick it away. I'll chase $5,000 bids on this one here at 172. 172,000 bid now, buyers. Now we get a bid 172. 172 here on the net at 172. Be 770 you be in the box seat at 172 here. 172 the bid at 172 the bid now, buyers. Now we get a bid 172 online at 172 here at 172 the bid at 172. 7. 177 at 177. Back online at 177 now. At 177 the bid now. It's a very special car. 177 here. 17 and we're on the market. 177, Online. we sell them out, 82. 82. 182 here, at 182, the bin now, ladies and gentlemen, we will sell this out Selling. today, on Gonna the market go. here, Amazon. at 182, 182,000, at 182 now, who's got five to play, at 182, 182, the bin now, 182, the bin now, we're going to bid 182, and we sell them out here today, you bid on this one, you buy it here today, at 182, 182,000, come on, can I tempt anyone for another five, at 182, you're going to miss out, 182,000 here, at 182, the bin at 182,000 here we sell them today. At 182 now, 182,000 dollars now. At 182, come on, it's a lot of car. It's the Cobra there. At 182 now. At 182, can you share any more history, Ryan? Uh, mate, just with the Cobras, one sold in uh, I think Rocky about four months ago, and it made over 300k. Um, it was one of the first 30, but this car has got a lot of provenance about it. Like it's a one owner, that, and that's the thing. A lot of people don't. Really, there wouldn't be too many. Phase three Falcons or XC1. I don't know too many Australian built muscle cars that still belong to the same owner from you. So that has got to do a lot of uh, giving this car a lot of credence being a one owner car. And it's got a bit of motorsport history, which is pretty special. Like the Northern Cherries, that Cannibal Rum was a huge thing when it came out. Um, and this car's been one of the com competing cars. And so that's, you know, adds a bit of provenance to it as well. It's a, it's a great car. And uh, they don't make them anymore. So someone, if there's a copper owner or someone that wants to put another one with their collection out there, they should definitely jump on, jump online and have a crack at this one. Great car. And the engine, wow. It just... When we started this thing out in the carport, car park this morning, people came from all over the place. I <laughs> just came out to listen to it. It sounded that great. So I'll just buy it for the sound, to be honest. But uh, great car, great history with it. I'll pass it back to you guys. Well said, Ryan. Oh, we're at 187,000, 192. 
and straight back online. online. 192. 192. At 192, the Vinny Buyers now. We get about $192,000 here. And we sell them out today at 192. It's a lot of car. 192 here. At 192, great history there. 192. At 192, the bid. At 192, as they battle it out online. The two horse race. At 192 here. At 192, the Vinny, we get a bit of 192. $1,000 here. At 192, the bid. At 192, there have been another 500. You never know. You get them us out. We sell them out here today. At 192. At 192, there have been. We've got a bit of 192. Last at 192, chance. last chance. If you're online there, 192. We're at 192,000. Last bid. You never know. At 192, there have been. We're all over and done. First call on the floor. 192, are we all done? A second call. 192, we all done and finish. Bid now if you're online. 192,000 for the third and final call. Out we go and done. Close the floor. Sold online, 192,000. Well bought. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. Back over to Ryan with the next lot, like 67. Hey, guys. <laughs> hey, Ryan. I got all excited after that. Some lucky owner's got a great copper to take home. Have a look at this. Holden VK V8 wagon. I actually bought one of these brand new in 1984. It wasn't purple, it was red, but... Um, what a great car these things were when they first came out. They had the black throw weight in them. Uh, this one, that's not a factory colour as you can probably tell. Uh, but V8, Commodore, anything, there's always someone out there wanting to buy it. You could uh, just leave it the way it is and drive it or do it up a little bit. Just pull the bonnet. But wait, you see underneath the bonnet on this one. It's very, very different. If the young fella in here can uh, get that up. He's doing his best. He's... Anyway, we'll keep that till later, but V8 wagon, 5 litre auto, it's got the balina trim and everything in it, uh, and a pretty special old car. They were a great thing when they first came out, and uh, they, uh, they've got the full instrument dash and everything on them, so something a little bit different. Could do with a tidy up, but it's all there. Back to you, Billy. Thank you, Ryan. Uh, what a result on that Cobra. Here come the Holdens, and we've got an online bid of $1,400. We're 100% unreserved on the Holden. And uh, I'd like to introduce Dollar Bill Freeman to the podium. He'll be taking us through the Holdens. Welcome back, Bill. Thanks, Lee. Uh, great result on that last car, too. Um, but here we come, onto the GMH mark. What have we got? 1,400 to get him away, Lee. Hundreds are in. Yeah, it's 1,400 to be down there now, but a 1,400 to be down there, but a 1,400 to be down there, but a 1,400 to go down there, but a 1,400 matter. It's 1,400 quick, you'll have a nod. It's 1,400 to be down there, now it's cheap 15. It's yeah. 15 on the floor. It's 15 here now, but a 1,500 to be down there, but a 15 here, one more to play. It's 1,500 to be down there, but a 1,500 now, but a 15. It's on the market. It's 1,500 now. It's 15 to be down there, but a 15 be down there, but a 15 quick, you'll have a nod. It's 15 here. It's 15 money's here. Tell me when online. Close, Lee. 16 online. You're out, sir. You're another 100. 17 here. It's 1700. It's 17 on the floor. It's 1700. Be down there now, but a 17. Then now, but a 17. Be down there, but a 1700. We've got. Your bid. 17. On the floor. We'll give online help. Five, five, seconds. Or five seconds to go to come back, sir. Money's yours. Money's yours here at 18 online. You're at 19. Make it 19. Make it 2000. He's got to turn the corner. What do you reckon? 1900 it is. 1900 to be down here now, but a 19 to be down, but a 19 bidder. 1900 here. 1900 to be down. Money's on the floor. 1900 here. 1900 to be down, but a 19 here now, but a 19. Tell me when online Two. shot. 2000 online. I told you you should have done it. At 2000 to be another 100 to play, sir. 2000 to be now. <laughs> nope. You sure? Been with me all the way. One. 21, that's a way. At 2100 bid now, but at 2100 bid now, but at 2100 bid now. 2100 now. 2100 we bid. 21 it is. Is online coming back? Wait and see. 2100 yes. here. Two, you're out. One 23, more. 23, you are. 23. 23. 23. Four. 24. It's only money, he says. 2400. 2400 a bid now. 2400 a bid now. Front. It's a V8, isn't it? Engine's worth that. 2400 all day. 2400 bit down here now. Your money here on the floor? Yep. 2400. How's online? We'll wait and see again. Give him a little bit. 2400, oh. that's it. 2400 quickly. Sell him away. One strike, then final. Sold. Your money at 2400 to buyer. 246. 970, well bought. Over to you, Ryan. What do we got next? Next one coming through here, Billy, is a VN Calais, VNV6, uh, running a set of VL Walkinshaw wheels on it. 
Uh, these were the first of the V6s of VNs, that's correct, they are too, the first of the Buick V6s. It's got the Mulberry Velour trim. Uh, it's all there, it's got a couple of little spots of rush around the back window and everything, but uh, all the trims there. As I said, V6, the, the interior trim colour, that burgundy vinyl and, and velour, something a bit different. But gee, these things are getting old now, and uh, this isn't a bad example. Spend a little bit of money on paint and panel on this thing, you'd have a good old cruiser. I'll pass it back to you, Lee. Thank you, Ryan. We've got an online bid of $750. What's it worth, Bill? $750, and there we go. 50s are into play. It's $750, bid down, bid down, $750, bid down, $750, bid down, $750, bid down, online bidder. It's $750, better. $750, bid down, $750, bid down, look right to play. $750, better. $750, bid down, bid down, $750, bid now. It's $750, bid. Just watch your hand out there, so you got my attention. It's $750, bid now. 750 a mid now, but a 750 better now. It's 750 quick, you all over and done the floor. 750 quick, you all over and done. 750, roll him through there, boys. Over to you, Lee. Thank you, Bill. We've got an, um, an online raffle prize winner. It's Andrew Watts from Parkinson, Queensland. So, Andrew, thank you very much for your support and uh, hope you're enjoying the auction as much as we are. Your name has been drawn, so you do have two cars to come back to us online and give us the draw number. Still thousands of dollars uh, to be won in the draws, so we haven't seen the big one go off yet. Andrew, good luck. Let's go back to auction and um, uh, see, what else, see what's coming through next. Well done, Andrew. Thanks, Lee. Next, didn't make it in, not rolling through today, but lot number 70. We've got a 94 VR Commodore Executive. It's the Series 2, indicating just over 260,000 Ks. It is the V6 dual fuel, the four-speed auto in Dove Silver. Uh, very powerful for a dual fuel vehicle. Uh, it's got the factory height, the genuine hubcaps there. Um, it's just, just a two-owner with full service history as well. It's got the books, presents very well. Ready to go to a new home. Leroy? All right, thanks, Toby. We've got $750 online. Let's go, Bill. $750 it is. 50s are in again, ladies. Great to have Kevy join us down from the podium here, mate. It's been hot work up there. Oh, mate, it has been, mate. It's been a fantastic auction, but uh, goodness me, mate, it's so comfy down here. It's yeah, fantastic. Absolutely, that's why we don't leave. <laughs> and how was that Cobra? Mate, oh, that was unbelievable. I'll tell you, oh, do I sound a bit croaky after it? <laughs> you do, mate, you mate, do. I, I had a lot of fun up there, mate. That Little was really struggles. good. Absolutely, absolutely. <laughs> Toby was thinking about getting that printed on a meme or something on a shirt or something. So that's That'd one of cool, my catchphrases. Nice, uh, nice No, nah, mate, I had a lot of fun up there. Those cars were doing really well, so. Absolutely. Yeah, really good. Let's go back to the podium, see what this Holden makes. Through Here's a Tirana. It's a UC. So these were the last of the Tiranas, the very last. It's a Sunbird. Um... And uh, all the body panels are there. Like you could d easily turn this into a uh, SLR 5000 replica or an Anon X replica. All the bits are there. Um, and I think he's got a spare engine and gearbox with this car, if I'm right. So it's got a bit there. Uh, the trim's not too bad. The top of the back seat's a bit sunburned. The dash is all intact. The chrome work on the front's not too bad. Uh, she's an old survivor. I remember these were brand new. They were selling them for about 3,900, I think the Sunbird started off at. So uh, let's see where it ends up today. I'll pass it back to Lee. All right. Thanks, Ryan. We are offering this car today completely unreserved. We've got an online bid of $2,300. Over to you, Bill. $2,300 is a pretty good investment, wasn't it? OK, there we go. Logbooks with this car, ladies and gentlemen. Original purchase receipt. OK, what have we got, Lee? $2,300. 23 it is. 200 are in. You got it. 200 are in, ladies and gentlemen. At 2300, you're playing for keeps. At 2300, bid no reserve. At 2300, better. At 23 bid down in now, but at 2300, bid now, but at 2300 on the UC Tirana. At 2300, a mid. At 2300, bid down in now, but at 2300, bid now. At 2300, better. 2300, it is. Look for turn to play. 2300, what do you reckon, ladies and gentlemen? 2300, a mid. At 2300, a bid down. Excuse me. 2300 better. 2300 bid now, but 2300 quickly. At 2300, I'm going to sell him away. At 2300, once, twice, third and final. Sold. 2300 to buyer. 183883. Well bought. Okay, over to you, Lee. All right, time to, give, uh, to announce some more raffle prize winners. So, Bill, you'll do the honours for me this time. Absolutely. Some, uh, some raffle tickets. So, have your raffle tickets ready, everybody. Good luck. Okay, uh, F66, Scott G. F66, we're looking for Scott G. 
Well done, Scott. So if you could come forward and see Nathan, and we'll call the uh, prize shortly. Let's keep the auction rolling. Thank you very much, Leroy. Up next, lot 72, we've got a very tough 1974 Holden HQ Ute, indicating just over 114,000 Ks. The VA petrol three-speed auto is a classic 70 Ute. It's upgraded with some uh, 80s W Breeze front end and dash. Um, it's had a few mods there as well. Uh, a bit of work done to it with a turbo 400 transmission and a stage two shift kit. All right, so check this one out, Benny. Here we've got a uh, we've got a HQ Ute mm. mate coming up. Mm. Looks uh, looks pretty tough. This thing. It Wild does, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. absolutely. Uh, it's got the 350 Chev, uh, 750 double pumper up top. Yep. So uh, out to a nine inch in the rear with a uh, 3.9 uh, mini spool. So it's got some tough. It's got a tough drive line in it, mate. That just sounds like get up and boogie to me. Oh, absolutely, mate. <laughs> Let's go back to the podium and see what it makes. Eh? Absolutely. Seven's happening bid, 500's in, ladies and gentlemen. 11.7 bid down now. 11.700 bid down in now. 11.7 bid now. 11.7 bid now. 11.7 bid now. 11.7 it is. 11.7, ladies and gentlemen. Here, 11.7 here, looking for 500 more. 11,700 a bid. 11,700 bid down in now. 12.2. 12.2, your money. 12-2 it is, 12-2 and bid now, but a 12-2 bidder. 12-2 and bid down here. A 12-2 and bid down in now, but a 12-2 and bid now, but a 12-2 bid now, but a 12-2 it is. 12-2 here on the floor. At 12-2 there, how's online, Lee? Quite online. 12-2. 12-2 <laughs> it is now, but a 12-2 now, but a 12-2 and bid now, but a 12-2 better. 12,200 on bid here. Yes. 127. 127 here now, but a 127 here now, but a 127 a bid now, but a 127 a bid now, but a 127 here. At 12-7 now. At 12-7 there, five and a more to play. At 12-7, how's your people? At 12-7. At 12-7 a bid down here now, but a 12-7 now, but a 12-7 a bid. Yes. One more, 13 2, he says. 13 2, I'm said now, but a 13 2, I'm bid now, but a 13 2, I'm bid now, but a 13 2. 13 2, better. 13 2, I'm bid down in now, your, your money man. here. At 13 2, at 13 2, I'm bid now, but a 13 2, bid now, but a 13 2. 13,000, turn a bit, ladies and gentlemen. 13 2, 13,000, turn a bit here. How's online? Timing out there yet? Yeah. 13-7, 13-7's on the phone, 13-7 a mid there, one more sir, 13-7 a mid now, but a 13-7 a mid now, one more, at 13-7, what do you reckon, 13-7, 13, 14-2 yeah. 14, he says on the floor, 14-2, 14-2 a mid now, but a 14-2 a mid now, but a 14-2 better, 14,000 turn a mid, <coughs> excuse me, 14-2, 14-7, 14-7, excuse me, 14, you sure? 14, 7, money's here. 14, 7, a bid now. 14, 7 here. At 14, 7, a bid. 14,000, 7, our money's here. At 14, 7 there. Shut online. 14, 7, a bid now, but a 14, 7 quickly. At 14,700, it is. 14, 7. Okay, over to you, Ryan. Thanks, Billy. Uh, coming through, is a, it's got the WB front, but it's actually a HZ one tonner. Uh, it's running a fuel-injected 5-litre engine. It was a factory 5-litre carburetted car. It's now running the updated 5-litre injected engine and a 5-speed gearbox. Pretty cool old one tonne of this. Uh, the paintwork's good. Uh, it's got a good quality steel timber tray. Uh, real 80s-style uh, alloy mags on the old Chevy Armour lights, I think they are called back in the day. They could probably do with replacing. But GDS dash, uh, bucket seats, GDS steering wheel, a good old classic, uh, good old classic Holden one tonne. Let's see where it ends up. Back to you, Lee. Thank you. And in very good, Nick. Ryan, thank you. We've got an online bid of $10,600. 10,600 is 500 supply. 10 6 meter. 10,600 bid down in Abra. 10 6 a bid now, but 10 6 a bid now, but 10 6 meter. 10,600 bid now, but 10 6 here now, but 10 6 meter. 10 6 here. 10,600 bid now, but 10 6 here now, but 10 6 looking for 11 1 to play. 10 6 it is. At 10 6 a bid now, but 10 6 bid now, but 10 6 here. At 10,600 bid now. At 10 6 here. At 10 6 a bid quick, you'll have it done. At 10,600 quick, you all have done at 10,600. We're rolling through there at 10.6. Okay, over to you, Ryan. Coming through here is a VB, uh, sorry, VC V8 four-speed Commodore. Uh, second generation Commodore. It's just a base L model. Um, I don't know what sort of polish they used on the bonnet, but it wasn't a good quality one. But uh, this car would be good. Like, the body's straight enough. The paint needs, needs doing. But, uh, gee, you could make a lot of car out of this for probably not a lot of investment. Uh, has got the... It's got the economy gauge in the dash. Four-speed manual, it's still got the factory velour trim, uh, but does need a repaint. But, but in saying that, with a repaint, this car could present very, very nicely. I'll swing it back to you guys. 
Thanks, thanks very much, Nathan. We've got an online bid of $4,700. Over to you, Bill. $4,700 there on the uh, 81 Commodore. At $4,700 bid now, but a $4,700 bid now, 200 to play. $4,700 bid now, but a $4,700 bid now, but a $4,700 bid now, but a $4,700 bid now. $4,700 bid now, at $4,700 bid now, but a $4,700, 200 to rent. At $4,700 now, at $4,700 bid now, but a $4,700 bid now, but a $4,700 bid now. At $4,700 quick, you'll over and done. At $4,700 quick, at $4,700 finish on the floor. <clears throat> 4,700 better. Hit 4,700 now, but a 4,700 here. 4,700. Look for two or more anywhere. 47 it is. How's online, Lee? Quiet online. 47 there. What's this round of VC? VC, Billy. That's correct. VB's the first series. I think 78 they came out. And then VC's were in 80. 80 to 81. Right. Yeah. Very short run on the VC. OK, I remember the old Econo gauge. OK, there we go. 4,700 there. It's on the market. You're playing for keeps. At 4,700 now. Turn them all there. At 4,700, money's here. At 4,700 bid now. At 4,700, going to sell him away. 4,700 quickly. One strike, third and final. Sold 4,700. Well bought. To buy a 108041. Well bought. OK, over to you, Lee. Yeah, thanks, Phil. Um, there's a first time for everything, so on the Lloyd's Classic Raffle Draw, we um, called an in-house bidder, Scott G, that was green ticket F66. He has gone home, and he's still watching the auction. So he's asked if we can pull it, um, if Ryan, if you'd be able to open a draw for him. Certainly. He's requested draw number five. So, Scott, we've draw got your back. Number five. Thanks for watching here. online. Ryan's going to open so, up for you. So if Scott's not in, does that mean him and I go hard? No, no. This, this is all for Scott, Ryan. Okay, what a shame. Oh, yeah. Scott's going to have to draw another draw because that one's... Uh, round up. MT. Number four? Let's, let's round up or down or whatever's closest right to you. Uh, right. oh. It's a big day for Ryan. <laughs> <laughs> Scott. I won't be greedy, Scott. You can have the draw. <laughs> yeah. I know we said we had your back, Scott, but uh, not sure if you feel that way right now. We'll get that in the post for you. Well done. Thanks, guys. Alrighty, coming up next, lot number 75. Oh, not the Kingswood. We've got a 1974 Holden HQ Kingswood Utility. That's uh, rear, rear wheel drive indicating just over 92,000 Ks. Uh, this is one true survivor car. Um, it's hard to find these ones that are in original unrestored condition, but we've got one. It's got the factory 202 low compression engine, um, and it's one of the last ones to roll off the Melbourne production plant. It's the last of the HQs built, and it's got four original keys coming with it. We've got a, a, a letter there from Holden, Historical Services, that uh, verifies the matching well, number. I'm going to say it. Not the Kingswood. Not the Kingswood. Did you leave your money on the fridge? <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> I won't say the next bit. Don't look at this thing, mate. This, is, uh, this has got potential to be a really, really... Good car. Uh, it's a it's a lovely little thing as it is. Yeah. I mean, very original. Yeah. Um, Ninety two thousand odd uh, kilometres from new. Um, it just looks like a dead original car to me. Absolutely, absolutely. Mm. Mate, look at if you if you spend a bit of time on it, a bit of money, it wouldn't take much. A bit no. of paint, you know, a good little a good little tune, mate. Set of tyres, mate. That'd be a good little car. And like if you could if you could hang on to that and keep that for what say ten years, yeah. you know, ten years down the track, that could be worth a lot of money. Absolutely right. Yeah. Uh, great investment. Absolutely, absolutely. But look, it did it. It happened with all the, all the Tarantas, happened yep. with all the Monaros, yep. you know, and they're only going up and up in value, so yeah, That's it's right. good. Anyway, but we'll head back to the action, mate. We'll see how this one ends up. It is at 5,800 bid now. 5,800 better. At 5,800, quick, you'll have none here. Had its time. 5,800 bid now. At 5,800, you over and done. We'll roll him through there, 5,800, and over to you, Ryan. Mate, uh, we've got a nice, you'd nearly call that wild violet, that colour, Billy, a Ford colour, but it's on this... Holden one tonner. Um, it's running a throw weight and a five speed super box. The paint could do with a bit of attention. The paint's a little bit, a uh, little bit crazed, a little bit uh, rough in edges. But maybe if you gave it a good buff back or something like that. But it is a throw weight five speed uh, one tonner steel and timber tray, GDS dash. So it's got the, it's got the makings of a good car. I'd probably just repaint the car and spend a bit of time on it. But the powertrain's right. The wheels aren't too bad. It's got the right dash in it. Uh, the tray's done quite well, actually. That, that timber tray looks quite smart. No. So there's a bit of life left in the old girl yet. I'll pass it back to you, Lee. Thank you, Ryan. Great summary. We've got an online bid of $7,600.
Over to you, Bill. 7,600 on the HZ1 tonner. 3085 speed, be a great cruiser. Okay, 7,800 is 300 inch, ladies and gentlemen. It's 7,800 a bit now. 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 7 it's 7800 a bit now. It's 7800 a bit down here now, but it's 7800 now, but it's 78 and go. It's 7800 here, what do you think? 7800 here, ladies and gentlemen. It's 7800 now, here's on line, Lee. It's 7800 a bit now, but it's 78 quick now. It's 7800, you all done 7800. Roll him through there. Okay, over to you, Lee. Thank you, Bill. <laughs> all right, we're going to, uh, let's give away some more money, shall we? Why not? All right, so. On viewing online, we have Brett Pemberton. Well done, Brett. We have, uh, you've been successful online. And, uh, and Brett's your, your husband. Your, your wife's in the crowd and she's very Pemberton. Ah, oh, that would have been so ironic, wouldn't it? All right, so Brett, congratulations. Uh, thank you for your support. You've got to get back to us in the next two cars and we'll open a draw for you. I'm pretty confident all the chickens have been chosen now, so it's got to be cash left, but... Lee, let's Not hope wrong. Brett's wife isn't sitting with him. <laughs> yeah. He's a Sorry, Brett. All right, Bill, and I'll get you to do the honours. We've still got some great attendance here, so let's draw an in-house raffle ticket. Absolutely. Get, that, uh, get the tickets over here, mate. Okay, we have a, um, a green ticket. <clears throat> Put my glasses on so we can see. F45, Trevor B. F45, Trevor B, are you here with us? Trevor, he's probably out there looking at the A9X. We'll pull another one. Okay, what do we got? We've got a, a green ticket F50, Mike H. F50, Mike H, are you here, Mike? Okay, there we go. Nathan E, green ticket F48, Nathan E. One more, Lee. Okay. Nathan E's not here. Okay, there we go. F64, Graham C. Graham C, F64. All right, so if you are any of those winners, please come forward and see Nathan. We'll draw the prizes shortly, and congratulations, Brett Pemberton from New South Wales. Thanks again for your support. I hope you're enjoying the auction. Let's go back to the auction action, and we'll draw your prize shortly. Still plenty of money to give away. Toby. All righty. Up next, we've got lot number 76, which is the 76. No. 77. Oh, it's not playing the game. There we go. Just come through. The 72, Holden HQ Belmont. Uh, so it's the uh, six-cylinder petrol, yeah, so indicating uh, very well. This next one, Benny, we've got another example of a really original ute mm. here. Mm. It's uh, a little bit like that last one that we saw earlier on, but it's an EJ. Uh, again, popular as well. Oh, so, absolutely, yeah. absolutely, mate. And people will be getting on these, uh, you know, all over the place because you can take them to Denny Ute Muster, you can do lots of things with them. They're just an iconic piece of Australian history, really, aren't absolutely, they? Absolutely, absolutely. The thing I like the most about these over, like, uh, 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 like the HQ or something, is the pointy nose. Oh, yeah. oh, I love the pointy nose, mate, and especially like the Tiranas as well. It just, uh, yeah. It's just that point of difference. Really. Absolutely, and yeah. a lot of people put the WB fronts on or whatever, yeah, yeah, yeah. but this is a style side as well, not yep. just a not just a tray back. Yep. So the style side is quite rare, and we've seen two in this auction, so there you go. Yeah, there you go, there you go. We find them all here at Lloyd's, don't absolutely. we? Absolutely. <laughs> Right, let's uh, let's head back to see what Bill can do with it up in the stand. Now, but it's six six men now, but six six. It's six six hundred a bit now. Six is six hundred a bit now, but it's six six matter. Six thousand six hundred a bit now, but it's six six now, but it's six six matter. Six thousand six hundred a bit online gone quiet. Quiet online, Bill. Six is six hundred a bit now, but it's six six now, but it's six six matter. Six six hundred had its time. Six thousand six hundred, ladies and gentlemen, you finish here. Six thousand six hundred, and away we go. Roll him through there, boys. At sixty-six, over to you, Ryan. Mate, the next one coming through is another classic old Holden. It's an EJ, uh, pre-runner to the popular EH Holden. But EJs are pretty rare these days because everyone loved their EHs, and the EJ was a bit of uh, like the ugly sister sort of thing. And uh, most of them got knocked around and uh, written off, whatever. This is a Good old car. It's had a paint at some stage and it could probably do with another one. Uh, I can't see a lot of rust popping out of it. There's a few little bubbles down the bottom of the guard there, but 
it's got good bones there. So if you wanted a, a restorer, this is probably one to have a look at, but you would have to probably bare metal it. But it's all there, it does run, and it's an early Holden. So we all love our Holdens here at Lloyd's Auction, so I'll pass it back to you, Lee. Absolutely, Ryan, thank you. We've got an online bid of $8,000. Eight thousand on the edge. Oh, away we go, ladies and gentlemen. Three hundred are in. Eight thousand, and be down. 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 Three hundred to play. Eight thousand, ladies and gentlemen. Eight thousand, and be down. 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 I love these old things. Russ Hins used to have one of these. Remember Russ Hins, Billy? The Minister for Everything? Yes. He had, uh, he had a WB Caprice. I used to see him driving back from the Gold Coast all the time. Well, he didn't drive. He used to sit in the passenger because he usually had a few beers under his belt. Underneath the bonnet of this thing, have a look at this. How original is that? Absolutely gorgeous. All the pollution gear is still on it. The big, uh, the big GM air conditioning compressor. Uh, just a classic car. And 100 Ks, there wouldn't be too many WB Caprices around with that sort of mileage on them. And these are a classic. In fact, Peter Brock got hold of the Statesman back in 83 and 84 and called them Magnums and used to put upgraded camshafts and everything in the engines and different suspension. Look at this. That is absolutely gorgeous. They don't get much better than this, Billy, I tell you. What a survivor. Now, if someone out there wants a good Statesman, and this is a Caprice and it's a Series 2, so it's got the better suspension, and uh, they just improved trim and a few little things. Look at the sheepskin seat covers. Beautiful car. Let's give it back to the boys. Thanks very much, Ryan. We've got an online bid of $18,000 on the Statesman. Let's go to auction, Bill. What's it worth? OK, 18000 I reckon it's worth more than that. At 18000 they're genuine. They're 100000 k Looks a good half. 18 half. 500, ladies and gentlemen. 18 half. And bid now, but 18,500. Now on the phone. 18,500 bid, and away we go. At 18 half. And bid now, but 18 half. Bid now, but 18 five. Now, but 18 half. Now, but 18 five. 19 online. 19 it is there, but a 19 and bid now. Round it to 20 on the phone. 19 on bid. 19 and bid now. Yes. 20? Just confirm your 20 on the phone, or...? Yep, 20. 20,000 on the phone, there we go. 20 in bid now, 20 in bid, one's now, Lee. Yep. Thousands are in now. Hit 20,000 in bid now, 20 in bid now, 20,000 in bid now, 20,000 in bid now, 20 in bid now, 20 in bid now, 20 in bid now. Hit 20,000 in bid now, 20,000 in bid now, 20,000 in bid there. Hit 20,000 in bid here. One, hit 21, hit 21 on the right. 21 and mid-nav, 21 and mid-nav, 21 and mid-nav, 21 and mid-nav, 21 here. 21,000 and mid-there. At 21,000 and mid-nav, 21 and mid-nav, 21 and mid-nav, 21 better. 21,000 in the ladies and gentlemen. At 21,000 and mid-nav, 21, one more to go. At 21 there. At 21. At 21, one more to play. At 21,000 and mid-nav, 2. He's back. 22,000 and mid-nav. 22,000 and mid-nav, 22 and mid-nav, 22,000 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 23,000 here, half online, 23 and a half online. Four, 24 on the phone, two horse race. 24 and a half thousand now, oh sorry Lee, yep, it's got to go too. It's on the market there ladies and gentlemen, a 24 and mid now, but a 24 and mid now, but a 24 bit of half online, 24 and a half, five, 25 straight back. 25,000 straight back. If you're watching at home, bid up quick. At 25,000, and now at 25 and a half, 25,5 online, he's back. Six, he's out. 26,000 on the phone. 26 and a half on the phone. 26 and a half on the phone. Thousand, Seven and a half. 27 and a half online, thousands to play now. 27 and a half on mid now, but a 27,5 now, but a 27,5. 
27,500. We'll give the phone bidder a little bit of time. 27,500. I don't think you'd find a better one. 27,500. Bids online. How's the phone bidder, Nath? 27,500. Phone's out. Okay, there we go. 27,500 online. We're going to sell him away, ladies and gentlemen. At 27,000 a bit now. At 27,500 for the first, second, third and final call at 27,500. Sold. Well bought. Buy a number. 246935. Okay, well bought. Over to you, Lee. Thank you, Bill. What a holding. What a result for the owner. Well done. We're going to give away some more cash. So, Ryan, would you please be able to open draw number 37? That's for Brett Pemberton in Cherrybrook, New South Wales. Brett Pemberton, lot He's number... He's feeling lucky. He's oh, Brett. To us especially. <laughs> oh, what a feeling. <laughs> All right, well... Congratulations, Bill. We'll get that in the post for you. Uh, sorry, Brett. We'll get that in the post for you. And uh, keep your online comments coming through. We appreciate your support and all the activity online. Hope you're enjoying the auction. Let's get back to selling some cars. Over to Toby. Thank you very much, Lee. Lot number 80 coming up next. Uh, this is more my era. We've got a Holden Senator, the VX Series 2. Uh, these things are as rare as they come. Only one of 12 Series 2 factory manuals made. Um, and we've got, we've got one up for auction. 2001, uh, factory manual, factory sunroof, full service history at the place of purchase. Um, Righto, Benny, here mm. we go, mate. We've got a senator. Have mm. a look at these, mate. These were, uh, these were luxury, weren't they? Absolutely the right. Yeah. Absolutely right. The HSVs, they, they knew how to do things right. It's got the LS engine in it, six-speed manual, which is a little bit rare, Kevy. Uh, yeah. One of 12, I believe. Is that right? Mm. There you go. It was done in the factory manual, sold through by uh, Ralph De Silva when it was brand new. Which, if you cast your mind back to our HDT Monaro, we had the very first HDT race Monaro. It was sold from the yep. same dealership back in uh, 1969. There you go. There so you go. A bit, a bit of history there and uh, a great little car. Yeah, very good, very good. What do you think of the colour? I like it. I yeah. do like the green. You don't yeah. like it? Oh, I'm not, not so much of a fan, but uh, like it's, um, it's, it's a nice car. I'd probably prefer that car in a Jag in that colour. Yeah, but, gotcha. uh, but anyway, yep. uh, still popular, but uh, anyway, we'll see what it goes, uh, goes for at the auction. 600. Roll him through there, boys. Over to you, Ryan. Yeah, mate. Look at this beautiful old FC Holden 59 model. A special sedan. White over aqua over white. Rear Venetians, weather shields, and a nice old driver. So, beautiful car waiting for, waiting for a new home. Back to you, Lee. Thanks, Ryan. We've got an online bid of 19600 and worth every dollar. Have a look at it. It's beautiful. Over to you, Bill. What's 196. This is a beautiful car. Take a look at this. At 19600 here. Round him to 20000 on the floor if you want. At 19600 is happening. Bid better. 196 it is. At 19, 20, there. At 20600 At 20600 you're out, sir. At 20600 bid near. Money's online. 20600 bid there. At 20600 bid now. 20,600 bid now, but 20,600. At 20,600. 21, 1. 21, 1. 21,1. 500s are in. At 21, 1 it is. 21, 1 better. 21,100. And look at it. 21,100 here. This absolute gorgeous car. 21,6. 21, 6 online. Phone, you've got to be 22, 1 if you want. 21.6 is online. 21.6 online. 21.6 now. At 21,600, bids online. At 21.6. At 21.6 and bid now to 21.6. 21,600 it is. Chasing another 500 to play, ladies and gentlemen. 21.6. 21,600 there. 21,600 a bid. 21,600. How's the phone, mate? He can't only have one. 21,600 better. 21,600 is out. At 21,600, you over and done. 21,600 it is. Okay, over to you, Lee. Yeah, thank you, Bill. Time to draw some new uh, Lloyd's Classic Raffle Prize winners. So before we get the online one come through, Bill, I'll get you to draw the next in-house raffle winner. Okay, who's the lucky person going to be? Glasses on so I can see. Okay, he's got a great name. A green ticket, F53, Bill O. Bill O, are you here with us? All right, Bill, if you could come forward and see uh, Ryan, and we'll call your prize shortly. I've also got 
Peter Wild from New South Wales. So congratulations, Peter, and thank you for uh, watching the live stream with us today. I hope we hope you're enjoying it. Peter Wild, thank you for your support. Come back to us with a draw number. Still plenty of cash to give away. Thanks again. Let's go back to auction. Okay, thanks, guys. Have a look at this thing. HJ V8 Fire Speed. Uh, pretty cool old car. It is running a GDS dash, and it's the wood grain GDS dash, which was a pretty rare thing back in the day. I think they were in uh, Premier's, oh, Premier's and uh, maybe Statesman SLEs. Uh, wide and chrome sports wheels, twin headlight front. It's a pretty cool old cruiser. This You wouldn't have to do too much to this car at all. Um, I'd just maybe lower it a little bit in the, in the rear end and uh, just enjoy it. Like a very, very good looking car, nice and straight. The paint's got a good shine on it. Back to you, Billy. All right, thanks, Ryan. We've got an online bid of $12,500. OK, thanks, Lee. <clears throat> On the HJ sedan there, 12500 is 500 to rent. At 12500 bid now, but 12 and a half, bid now, but 12 and a half, bid now, but 12 and a half. 13,000 is there. 13, a bit down, but a 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 13, better. 13,000 is, ladies and gentlemen. 13,000 a bit down, but a 13, a bit down, but a 13, a bit down. 13 here. 13,000 it is. 13, a bit down, but a 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 13, five or more to play. 13,000 it is. 13, a bit down, but a 13, a bit down, but a 13, a bit down, but a 13, better. 13,000 here, what do you reckon, ladies and gentlemen? 13,000 a bit down. 13,000 better. 13,000 here, it's had its time. Hit 13,000 a bit now. Hit 13,000 quickly, all over and done. Hit 13,000 on bid. 13,000 it is. 13,000. Okay, over to you, Toby. Thanks, Billy. Uh, up next, not coming through today, unfortunately, but lot 83 is the 85 Holden VK Calo triple three pack. So we've got the sedan indicating just over 217,000 Ks, matching numbers, and the original engine. So this, uh, this colour, the um, dark green, is becoming rare and hard to find. Uh, original stereo tow bar, it's got the HD bonnet scoop as well as the HDT front grille. Um, it's been really driven in the past 13 years, as, as the vendors let us know, so it's ready to go to a new home, could be used as a daily car. Radio, Benny, here we go. Mm. We've got an 85 VK Calais, mate. That's 10 years older than me. I'm hoping I look that good, mate, in 10 years' time. <laughs> I doubt it. I doubt it, mate. But uh, well, tell us a little about these, mate. Well, this is what they call a triple three, Kevy. Uh, so it's a Calais, it's a V8, it's got all the gear on it. Uh, absolutely gorgeous car in cerulean, which cerulean. is uh, cerulean. Okay. So it's kind of a greeny blue, yep. and it's the same colour they used on the interiors of, uh, uh, you know, like the blue mini and that sort of thing. That's that interior colour. Um, I remember my uncle and my pop, my grandfather, had one at the same time. They both bought brand new VK Calais. Yep. One was a six, one was an eight, and they were just great cars. Yeah. Digital dash, all that sort of stuff. So cool. So 80s. Absolutely, absolutely. Mm. Anyway, we'll see what Bill can do with it up on the stand there. We'll head back to the stand. 15,500 about our money's online. 15,500. Hit 15,500 mid now, but a 15,500 quick, you'll have it done. Hit 15,500. Okay, we'll roll him through there. Okay, over to you, Toby. Thanks, Billy. Next one through, we've got the GTA, oh. GTA lookalike. GTA X U1 lookalike, but it's the 74 Holden Toronto LJ. Uh, Two-door coupe indicating 33,000 kilometres. Where are we? It's got the 2.8, the six-cylinder, four-speed manual. Um, it's got the Bathurst tank in it, the genuine Holden intake manifold as well. Um, it's ready to go to a new owner, someone who's going to cherish it, I guess. Uh, Lee. Righto, Benny, here we go. We're into the Tiranas now, mate, into oh, the yeah. big stuff. Oh, yeah. uh, now, we've got, a, we've got an XU1 Tribute here, the Tribute car, but, uh, mate, it, uh, it, it screams quality, you know, the build that went into this one. Uh, what do you know about this one, mate? Lovely car, mate, lovely car. LJ, so one of the best shapes that Holden ever produced. Uh, it's got a 173 in there, which is numbers matching, well, as far as numbers matching, can be in a Holden. Um, great, great car, great original car, uh, XU1 mock-up. So it's, someone's going to have a great deal of fun with that one, mate, I think. Oh, absolutely, mate. They're great cars. And you see them running around the road now, mate. I think it's great to see them out and about. Yeah, absolutely. Um, They're getting which, used. Absolutely, absolutely. Mm. Which, you know, if you bought a matching a on x you just couldn't do. You'd be very um, scared to drive, yeah, wouldn't you? Absolutely, yeah. absolutely. But very, very good car. So uh, let's, uh, let's see what Billy can do with this one today. I'm sure it's going to go to a great home for you. Thirty-one thousand. 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 Thirty-one
<laughs> got my attention, I tell you. <laughs> 31,000 a mid. Yep, 31,000. Don't worry, Mum said you can have it if you want it. Stick your hand up if you want. 31,000 a mid now. Yep, 31,000 a mid now. But 31,000 quick, you're over and now. Yep, 31,000. That is 31,000. Okay, over to you, Lee. Thank you, Bill. 31,000 for that is absolutely exceptional buying. We've got uh, a result for the online raffles. So, for Ooh. Peter, we have. Draw number 48, Ryan. If you could open draw number 48. Draw. Peter, good luck. We've got Ryan. He's, I think all the chickens are gone now, Ryan. Would that be right? I can't hear anything. Draw, but mate, it is a big draw. There could be a chook in here. Let's have a look. Draw. No, it's an envelope. All right. Oh, okay. Good luck, Peter. Let's see how quickly I can get this. Oh, oh I'm getting the, getting the hang of this, aren't I? Peter from yeah. New South Wales. Peter from New South Wales. You have run a $50 movie card voucher. So congratulations. Well done, Peter. In the mail for you. And uh, enjoy it. Thank you very much. It's auctions. Okay. Right. Uh, this car coming through now is a very, very special car. This is a HSV GDO Coupe. Now, this thing is a one owner car. The gentleman bought this car when he retired. It is absolutely stunning. It's only done 79,000 Ks. It's got all the logbooks with it, it's got all the service history with it. It's still got the black HSV cap, the leather pouch. All the brochures, everything that came with this car when it was delivered brand new is still with the car now. It is stunning. It's never been biffed. It's never been thrashed. It is absolutely... Look, even the headlights don't have any stone chips on them. The car is absolutely gorgeous. And as I said before about HSV Coupes, these things are going to be worth an absolute mozza in the next couple of years, in the not too far distant future. Finished in Sting Red, still running the beautiful factory five-spoke wheels, thank goodness, because most people have bought these things back in the day. Mm. The first thing they did was went and put a set of chrome wheels or something, which looked terrible. This is still got the factory wheels on it. Black trim and the pleated trim. It's absolutely stunning. This should be sold today, and someone should take it home and enjoy it for many, many years to come. I'll pass it back to you guys. That's great advice, Ryan. Thank you. On lot 86, we've got an online bid of $37,000. Okay, 37000 oh, Away we go, ladies and gentlemen. $37,000 a bid now, but a $37,000 a bid now, but a $37,000 a bid now, but it costs you 1000 to play. 37000 it is. $37,000 a bid now, but a 37000 here. 37000 it's a great car. Just short of 80,000 kilometres and presents as new. $37,000 a bid now. 37,000, ladies and gentlemen. 37,000, a bit now, but 37, a bit now, but 37, a bit now, but 37,000 here. 37,000 here. 37,000, what do you think? 37,000, a bit here. 37,000, bit now. 37,000, a bit now, but 37, a bit now, but 37, a bit now, but 37,000, bit now. 37,000, it is. 37,000 here. 37,000, a bit here, quickly. 37,000. Quite online. 37, it is. 37,000, ladies and gentlemen. 37,000 here. Yeah. 38. <coughs> 38. Money's on the floor. 38. 38,000 a bit now, but a 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 38,000 meter. 38,000 now. 38,000 now. 38,000. Quick, you all have none of 38,000. Quick little there, sir. What's your number? Okay, boys, we'll give you a ring shortly. Okay, what have we got next? Ryan. Mate, this one coming through. It looks like it looks and smells and feels like a VC Brock, but it's not. It's a VB. But uh, the guy's done a great job. It's running the factory Amsha wheels on it, uh, colour-coded bumpers, the HDT flares, uh, HDT steering wheel, in fact. Um, and it's, uh, it's a very, very good tribute, reproduction, whatever you'd like to call it. It's a throw eight. It is running a manual gearbox. And... Uh, as all the VC Brocks did back in the day, it's running the red velour trim, and the, I must say the trim's in very good order on this car. So it's not going to be the money of a genuine one, but uh, if you wanted to have something to drive and enjoy, well worth a look. I'll pass it back to you, Lee. Thanks very much, Ryan. We've got an online bid of $23,200. Over to you, Bill. Okay, 23 is the opening bid there. 500 to play, ladies and gentlemen. 23,200 it is. At 23,200, I'm bid now, but at 23,200, I'm bid now, but at 23,200. At 23,200, at 23,200, I'm bid now, but at 23,200. 23,200, turn it in, ladies and gentlemen. 23,200, at 23,200, I'm bid now, but at 23,200, I'm bid now, but at 23,200, looking for 500 to play. 23,200. 23-2 it is here, at 23-2, at 23-2, at 23-2 on the VC Brock Tribute. 
23,000, turn it here. What do you think, ladies and gentlemen? At 23, two and bid. At 22,000, three and a bid here. At 22, 3,200. 23,200 it is. 23,2. 2 How's online, mate? At 23, two. At 23, two quickly. At 22, three. At 23,200 dollars. Roll him through there. Okay, over to you, Lee. Thank you, Bill. We'll pass, move this car through and we'll get through to some more raffle prizes. So, um, we've got an online raffle winner of Jason Edwards all the way from Peakhurst, New South Wales. So, Jason Edwards, congratulations and thanks for your support. Make sure you get back to us in the next two cars with a draw number. We've got hundreds of dollars worth of prizes left to go. Ryan will be happy to open those and send those to you on, on your behalf. And, uh, Bill... I think it's time to draw a raffle prize for in-house as well. Okay. If you could do the honours. We've got some exciting cars to come. Thank you. That's Blue Ticket A01. Blue Ticket A01. Tara. So come forward, Tara, and see the uh, staff. See Nathan up here and we'll draw the prize shortly. And uh, for Jason Edwards online as well, congratulations, get back to us soon. And uh, thanks everybody watching the live stream. Back to you Ryan, let's go to auction. Thanks buddy. Coming through now is a 1970 HT Monaro. This thing's finished in burgundy metallic, uh, running a 350 engine, automatic transmission. A very, very good car. The colour looks striking, it's a pretty rare colour this colour. But uh, the car looks great, we have got the rear hub caps for it. Um, Sorry, it's running a manual gearbox, this car. It just needs finishing off. It, it's uh, been virtually fully restored, but just needs a few little trim bits and everything else to, to make it correct. But a great car, great colour combination. As we know, HT Monaros, HK Monaros and HGs are going crazy at the moment. And this is certainly a very, very nice example. Pass it back to you guys. Thanks very much, Ryan. We've got an online bid of $67,000, showing great value at that bill. Where does it finish? Absolutely on the HT uh, Monaro there, ladies and gentlemen, running the 350, 67,000, it's 2,000 to play. At 67,000, it'd be now to 67, it'd be now to 67, it'd be now to 67,000, it is. At 67,000 here. At 67,000, it'd be now to 67,000, it'd be now to 67, two to play. At 67,000, a bit. At 67,000, it'd be down in now to 67,000 here. At 67,000, it'd be now. At 67,000 here. At 67,000, it'd be there, two more. More to go. That's 67,000 it is. 67,000 there, quiet on the floor. At 67,000 on the HT 350 Monaro. At 67,000 a bit here. At 67,000 a bit. At 67,000 quickly. At 67,000 you all have done 67,000. 67,000 will roll him through there. Over to you Ryan. Mate the next one coming through is a HQ GDS sedan. Uh, this is a good car. I don't know the name of that colour, but it's a, it's a non-metallic orange, uh, running sports wheels as they should have come. They, they did come out with. Underneath the bonnet on the car has been uh, restated and looks very very original. I'll just pop that in a bit once they stop pushing it. If they're going to stop pushing it, that is. Hang on, let's have a look. Underneath the bonnet presents very nicely. Look at that, just like they were when they rolled out of the factory. Very nice car, Billy. Looking good. Everything's correct. Back to you, mate. Thank you, Ryan. We've got an online bid of $45,000. Let's go to auction. OK, 45,000 ones are in. <coughs> For the betting man, that's a loan of Rangers, that colour, Ryan. 45,000 a bid now. At 45,000 a bid there, ones are in. At 45,000 a bid down in now, but at 45,000 a bid down in now, but at 45,000 a bid now. At 45,000 a bid now. At 45,000 a bid down in now, but at 45,000 quick over and done here. At 45,000 a bid now. At 45,000 it is. At 45,000 you over and done at 45,000. 45,000. OK, over to you, Ryan. Mate, uh, have a look at this SLR Tirana. This one's a six-cylinder four-speed LX. Um, and I'd have to say it's probably the tidiest one we've had. It's, I love the old, back in the day, the under-dash air conditioning. Billy, you probably remember that when you were a kid. Under-dash air conditioning that used to freeze your kneecaps off. It's six-cylinder four-speed, showing 31,000 kilometres on this car, and I'd believe it. If you look at the door trims and the, and the dash and the seats and everything else, it looks very, very original. Jesus, I better get old matey to pull that bonnet, it's very tight. And uh, what a great car. It has got logbooks, service history and everything with it. And uh, just a lovely car. Underneath the bonnet, dead original. Beautiful car. So I'll pass it back to you, Billy, and um, let's see where it ends up. All right, thanks, Ryan. We've got an online bid of $37,500. 
Okay, 37,500 is now. Hit 37,500 and been now to 39,000, now to 39 online straight away. Hit 39 ones are in. Hit 39,000, now to 30, 41.5, now to 41.5, now to 41.5 online. 41,500 it is. 43 and a half now. 43 and a half thousand. Uh, SLR Tirana done a, uh, a very low 33,000 kilometres, ladies and gentlemen. 43,500 it is. At 43,500, number 43 now, 43,500 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 now, 45 and a half, 45 and a half mid now, but a 45 and a half mid now, but a 45 five, 45 five, at 45 five now, but a 45 Seven five, half. 47 and a half online, 47 and a half now, <coughs> 47 and a half thousand money's online, 47 and a half thousand mid now, but a 47 and a half thousand now, 47 and a half thousand mid now, but a 47 and a half thousand now, 49 and a half, 49 and a half thousand now, 49 and a half thousand it is. 49,500 now, but a 49,500 now. 49,500 now. 50 and a half. 50,500 online, he's back. 50,500 bid now, but a 50,500 bid now, but a 50,500 bid now. Nathan, how's the phone bidder? 50,500 bid now, but a 50,500 bid now. 50,500 bid now, but a 52 and a half. 52 and a half, ladies and gentlemen. 52 and a half thousand have been now, but a 52,500 here. Hit 52 and a half thousand have been now. Hit 52 and a half thousand on the phone. 52 and a half thousand now. We give online a bit of chance to come back. Hit 54 and a half, he's back. Online. 54 5, online. You're out on the phone. 54 5. 54,500 money's online. 54 and a half, 56 and a half. 56 and a half thousand now, 56 and a half thousand, 33,000 kilometres ladies and gentlemen, 56 and a half thousand, I've been able to 56 and a half thousand, I've been 56 and a half thousand, original log books and service books with it, 56.5, what do you reckon here, hit 56 and a half thousand there, 56 and a half thousand, money's here, we'll give online a little bit to come back, 56 and a half, if you're at home watching, now's the time to bid, 56 and a half now. 56,500. Okay, 56,500 it is. Okay, over to you, Ryan. Thanks for that, Billy. Uh, this one coming through now. I, I spoke to someone earlier about this car. Um, the gentleman that owned this car lived in the country. He fitted, like, you don't see many HG 350 Monaros fitted with cruise control. It's probably the first one I've ever seen. And it's got the little uh, little things on the front there that uh, make a whistling noise, keep the kangaroos off the road. This is a dead set, just a, a ripper car. Like you look at the old style mags on it. Like you'd rather have the factory wheels, but the, but just back in the old jelly bean wheels. Have a look at that. The little chrome spats here. It's just a good old car. It's uh, it's had a couple of bits of paint in, in its time, but all the interior is correct. The orange flecky uh, houndstooth trim. Just a classic car, mate. The guys enjoyed it for many many years and kept it preserved. So now it's time to move it on to a new home. So, Lee, I'll pass it back to you and let's see if we can uh, find a new house for it tonight. Thank you very much, Ryan. And I'm going to change it up a little bit. We've got to announce the uh, on last online raffle winner for the Classic Car Auction. So, Ryan, if we could open up draw number 17 for Jason Edwards in New South Wales. Draw yeah. number 17. Draw number 17. Dick Johnson's As race the bidding number. rises. Here we go. Let's on see what's... Oh, wow. Good luck, 17, Jason. Seventeen's been done and dusted. I need you to round up or down for Jace. Well, I think we might go to fifteen. How's that? Oops. Jace. Dice. Dice. Have Dice for Jace. Jace, send us your uh, your address and we'll get those in the post for you. Well done. And uh, we've got a, an astonishing lineup of cars to come, guys. So sit tight, enjoy the show. Let's go back to the auction. We've got an online bid of one hundred and four thousand dollars. Okay, on the 350 Monaro there. <clears throat> 104,000, ladies and gentlemen, 2,000 are in. 104,000 is now, but 104,000 to be now, but 104 bid now, but 104,000 is now, but 104,000 to be now. 104,000 to be now. 104, ladies and gentlemen. 104,000 to be now, but 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 104,000 to be now. 104,000 to be now. We're at the penultimate lot of the day, mate, and what a cracker. We've got a uh, GTS Monaro here, mate. Tell us about this. I love this car. They're a fantastic shape, aren't they? I mean, just oh. so iconic. Yep. And uh, this is actually a really, really great car. Gentleman's had it for a long, long time now. 
Did a respray on it, uh, had a little bit of uh, rust in the rear quarters, which is where they go. Uh, but this is absolutely rust free now. It's just a gorgeous, gorgeous car. Two speed power glide, which was an interesting option uh, to have. I don't think there were many HGs with two speed power glides, mate. Yeah, okay. Um, yeah. so I wouldn't be able to tell you, mate, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> a bit before my time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, me too. But uh, the, they reach across the ages, these cars. They appeal to everyone. I mean, you get young kids who love these things as well. Absolutely. Uh, as well as guys who saw them race at Bathurst back in the day. Absolutely, absolutely. And cruise control, Kevy. That would be pretty flash, mate, because like I had a 2004 Patrol that didn't even have cruise control. I so. don't think it was factory <laughs> fitted. I think it was fitted by the gentleman sometime after. Absolutely. But yeah. still a fantastic car and a really interesting option to have on that thing. And uh, in the orange, you can't go wrong with that colour oh, in a HG. Oh, I love it with the uh, with the black accents on it, mate, oh. as well. It just it mate, it sets it apart, doesn't it? Absolutely yeah. right. Absolutely, absolutely right. We should uh, we'll head back to the bidding though. See what Billy's up to, mate, and uh, hopefully we get this one across the line. Yep. Head over to the podium. 106 it is, 106,000 a bit there, but 106,000 a bit there, but 106 and bid. 106,000 now, look for two more to play. 106,000 a bit there, but 106,000 now. At 106,000 we're a bit late and gentlemen. 106. 106,000 it is. 106,000 a bit there, but 106,000 now, but 106,000 it is. 106. Over to you, Ryan. Uh, thanks, Billy. We've got a, uh, a very... Spe this is the star of the star of the auction of this car. This is... It's an Anonyx four-door Tirana, but it was the very first Anonyx produced by General Motors Holden. Uh, it, first Anonyx four-door. It o went on. It uh, left General Motors and became Holden's press test car. So what that means is Modern Motor or Wheels magazine, when they want to do a test on the, uh, on the new Anonyx four-door, this was the car they used. So it's got a great provenance. Uh, it's still running the original registration number. That's New South Wales Regio. When it came uh, from the factory, it was in Victorian Regio, but that's the Regio number it had. And a very, very good car with great providence. And the two lovely ladies are sitting in the car. They're the current owners of the car. Um, they're passing it up to get it auctioned off today. It, it's pretty sentimental. It's been in the family and it was, belongs to the lady's husband. It's a very, very special car. And uh, we're very proud that they've in, in, entrusted us to sell the car for them. So it's a great thing. I'll pass it back to you guys. Thank you very much, Ryan. A very important car, a very a massive opportunity. We hope it goes to a good home and someone that will appreciate it as much as the original owner did. We have an online bid of $320,000. Before we go, ladies and gentlemen, you've all watched the, uh, the video online. We've had about one and a half million hits so far on the 10 minute video. It explains the story of the car. Unfortunately, Sue that's in the passenger seat uh, lost... No, Sue's in the driver's seat. Sue's uh, lost her son last year. Uh, it was a son's pride and joy. Uh, Sue's so uh, daughter is in the passenger side, so they're here to, uh, to represent and honour uh, honor Mark for the car. He certainly knew what a great car was, ladies and gentlemen. You wouldn't get a better car. It is an SLR 5000 A9X. The very first PSN Day 9X GMH press car. It doesn't get any better, ladies and gentlemen. I think the previous record was 165,000 for a four-door A9X. We're at 330. We're at 330,000 dollars, ladies and gentlemen, and away we go. What are we looking for? Five. Five thousand are in. Got it. At 335. At 335. Mid now, but 335. Oh, now, 340. Online. At 340,000 now. At 340,000 now. The A9X four door. At 340,000 a bit. At 340,000 a bit. At 340,000. You're playing for keeps, ladies and gentlemen. We forgot to mention. Oh, you, you're the highest bidder. You'll own the car. It's 340,000 now. It's 340,000 a bit now. It's 340,000 a bit there. It's 340,000. Five more to go. It's 340,000 now. It's 340,000 a bit there. What do you think on the floor? It's 345. 345 online. 345,000 it is. At 345,000 a mid. At 345,000 now. At 340,000 a mid now. At 350. At 350 a mid. At 350. Four horse race. 350,000, ladies and gentlemen. At 350,000 a mid. At 350,000 now. At 350 a mid now. At 350,000 now. We'll give them a little bit of time. 350,000 it is. At 350,000 a bit now. At 350,000 now. At 350,000. How's Sue? 350,000 a bit. At $350,000. Anyone on the floor want to go? 
Five, three fifty fives on the phone, ladies and gentlemen. Three hundred and fifty five thousand a mid. At three hundred and fifty five thousand, you're playing for keeps. At three hundred and fifty five thousand. At three hundred and fifty five thousand, we're bid. At three hundred and fifty five thousand now. At three hundred and fifty five thousand. Don't forget it's on the market. Three hundred and fifty five thousand on the A nine X. 355,000 here. That's 355,000. We'll give those other uh, internet bidders a little bit of time to come back. 355,000 it is. 355,000, ladies and gentlemen. That's 355,000 a bid. 355,000 here. That's 355,000 here. That's 355. On the number one produced A9X four door car, ladies and gentlemen. Doesn't get any better. 355,000 there. Do you want to just open the bonnet and show the people yes, at home? Yes, certainly, buddy. Ryan, the uh, great condition that the car presents in. I'm behaving myself here. There. Mate, beautiful car, stunning car. I remember these things brand new. Billy, you would have done the same. Have a look at that. Just absolutely gorgeous. Hasn't been overdone. It's still all original under here. Like the, It's got the factory air cleaner still on it. Um, a homologation on these. Bill, they used to run Weber Carbies, all sorts of things, through the Holden dealer team and other places. This is the, just the standard production road car. Thematic fan, which, which was uh, what they did back in the day. But what an absolutely classic car and um, just fantastic, beautiful thing. And great bit of motoring history. So let's, we hope it goes to a great home today because certainly going to appreciate in value. And uh, as I said, these, the a and in the hands of Peter Brock and many other drivers won a lot of races. The, the Fordless was successful and hatchbacks were even more successful, but a bit of history here and a, and a very, very special car. Yep, thanks for that, Ryan. Also coming with the car, there's a, the full history bar, two years of ownership over the last 40-odd years. There's a full file there. Um, there's a uh, letter of authenticity from the A9X Club. There's the uh, paper clippings from the, uh, from the uh, newspaper. As we mentioned, it was a GMH press car. It's got everything there, ladies and gentlemen, and this is the car. 355000 the bid. We've had about five bidders there over the last $50,000. We'll give the other four a little bit of time to come back. 355000 it is. 355000 a bid down here now. It's $355,000 a bid. It's $355,000 a bid down here now. It's $355,000 a bid. It's $355,000 a bid. It's $355,000 a bid there. It's $355,000 a bid there. It's $355,000 a bid there. $355,000, ladies and gentlemen. It's $355,000. It's $355,000. And before we go away, Sue, I know Mark will be up there watching and he'll be very, very proud of you. $355,000. At $355,000 here. At $355,000 now. $60,000. At $360,000. At $360,000 there. At $360,000. We're going to set an Australian record for him. At $360,000 we're in. At $360,000. At $360,000. I mean, now it's $360,000 better. $360,000 now. How's the phone better? At $360,000. Thousand and bid at three sixty at three hundred sixty thousand here at three hundred sixty thousand and bid at three hundred sixty thousand better at three sixty here at three hundred sixty thousand and bid five he's back three sixty five you will not find another number one a nine extra runner this is the only one ladies and gentlemen the lowest PSN the um, GMH will tell you that the the there was a uh, hatch overtook this car on the production line and the hatch ran off just before this four-door did. But this has got the very first PSN number from Holden for the A9X car. There we go. 360,000, ladies and gentlemen. At 360,000, we're bid. 360. At 360, is that online or the phone? I can't remember. 365. On the phone. 365's on the phone. 365 it is. That's 365,000 a bit now. That's 365,000 here. That's 365,000 there. Looking for another 5,000 to play. That's 365,000 and we're selling. That's 365. That's 365,000. That's 365,000 a bit. That's 365. We had enough, do you think? We right to go? We're ready to go. Everyone's finished. You've had a go? 365. 365, ladies and gentlemen. That's 365,000 I call for the first. 365,000 I call for the second. 365,000 for an Australian record on the A9X. $365,000.
Sold. Very well bought. One very special car. Don't forget, ladies and gentlemen, we have the auction at Bathurst next Saturday. Well done, Sue. Don't forget if you've, uh, you want some very good cars or that you've got a nice uh, muscle or classic car, give our classic car team a ring through the week. Uh, there's still probably a little bit of time if you're down south and you want to get one into our Bathurst auction. Okay, there we go. I think that about wraps it up from the, uh, the team here up on the podium. So we might go over to Lee for the, uh, for the wrap up at the end. Sue, thank you very much for entrusting Lloyd's Classic Cars to sell the car. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen, and we'll see you next time. Finish, Ryan. Oh mate, it was just so great. It was great that they entrusted us with the car, and and the result we got them, I think, was fantastic. As they said, it's an Australian record, world record for an Anonic Strana. Wonderful people, and it was a, just the best result you could possibly wish for. And just another great auction. I'm very happy to be privileged to, to have that car to auction. That's right, another Australian record for the car, and the best result possible for a great family yeah. under some extreme circumstances. Definitely. We know that uh, by the people that we've spoken to on the phone about that car, we know that it's going to be going to a good home, yeah. someone that appreciates the car as much, but maybe more importantly, the story behind the, it. Yeah, the so, history behind the car. Fantastic result, and we're, we're just glad for them. And uh, look, it's been another great day here at Lloyd's. We've sold some great cars. We've, we haven't finished yet. We've got the motorbike auction, the classic motorbike auction coming up very shortly. Join us soon. Yep. Yep, join us soon for the uh, classic bikes. We're going to have a quick drink of water, maybe some uh, a bit of a sugar hit, some lollies, Ryan, yep. and uh, go back up on the podium and uh, sell an amazing collection of classic bikes coming up. What have we got on offer? Oh, mate, we've got Suzuki's, we've got Kawasaki's, we've got some Honda 6s, which are a pretty rare bike. We've got a Buell. Uh, mate, there's something there for everyone. There really is. It's, it's been a barn find. It's been in a, in a building in a shed in Toowoomba for many, many years. There's something for everyone. We've got some Suzuki Katanas, uh, Z1 R1000s, thousands, plenty of bikes. All right, so we're just about ready to get uh, cracking on the next auction. Some amazing results. Mm. The Cobra got a great result yeah. as well. Yeah. I know the uh, the vendor, will, the, the the custodian will um, will be very happy. Mm. So this, ladies and gentlemen, it's important to note that this dream will end after we sign out um, of a good day of classic car um, car bidding, and we'll be straight back on the Facebook page just above the on the news feed um, with the classic car auction. So we've got to wrap this one up. Stay tuned, we're going to have some more history. Go under the hammer shortly, jump onto the new stream. Thank you very much for your attendance. Lots of prizes, some great cars. Uh, Ryan, let's get back in position and do it all over again. Thanks, guys.